get started. I will not alt F4 this time. I promise. Or I, yeah, I, I won't promise anything. Bioware production. Hey, Tool. Oh. This game is like on another level from one. I feel like this one is way cooler. I like one, but two is like. I mean, it's freaking Martin Sheen, right? It is Martin Sheen. Right? Shepard did everything right. More than we could have hoped for. Copy. Commander Shepard uncovered the truth. And still, it's not enough. We're at war. No one wants to admit it, but humanity is under attack. But they're sending her to fight Geth. Geth? We both know they're not the real threat. The Reapers are still out there. And it's up to us to stop them. The Council will never trust Cerberus. They'll never accept our help. Even after everything humanity has accomplished. But Shepard... They'll follow her. She's a hero. A bloody icon. But she's just one woman. If we lose Shepard, humanity might well follow. Then see to it that we don't lose her. Ooh. Okay, one month after the devastating Geth attack on the Citadel, humanity seeks political control to Geth, ignore the human leader of the council, is forced to respond to evidence that the Reapers, enormous machines that eradicate all advanced civilization every 50,000 years in return, to tell these rumors the council has said with Commander Shepard that the Normandy to wipe out this last pocket of Geth's resistance officially. I read so fast. I read so fast. I read so fast. Oh, Rap God Pod. <laughs> Thank you so much for the 44 months. That is an insane amount of time. Thank you. Thank you for. I can't believe it's been four months. Disengaging already. FTL drives. Insane. Thank you so Emission much. Mission sinks active. Yeah. Wait. Was Board is Joker green. We are running walking? silent. We're wasting our time. Four days searching up and down this sector, and we haven't found any it's sign of death activity. For being part of the dino. Three ships went missing here in the past month. Something happened to them. My money's on slavers. The Terminus system is crawling with them. Picking up something on the long-range scanner. Unidentified vessel. How am I doing? I'm doing Looks great. like a cruiser. Doesn't match any known signatures. I am so high on this. So high. Cruiser is changing course. Now on intercept trajectory. Can't be. Stealth systems are engaged. There's no way a Geth ship could possibly. It's not the Geth. Brace for evasive maneuvers! Presley! Oh. Kinetic barriers down! Multiple hole breaches! Weapons offline! Somebody get that fire out! is ready for launch. Will the Alliance get here in time? Ah! I'm not doing this just so they can find our frozen corpses. Get everyone onto the escape shuttles. Joker's still in the cockpit. He won't evacuate. I'm not leaving either. Why not? Get to the damn shuttles! Game I'll haul Joker's crippled ass- Oops. Whoops. I wanted to lower the volume, I guess. Shepard! Get the hell out of here! I am not cried, everyone. Everybody in! Go, go, go! No, it's super loud, I'll fix it. <laughs> okay, cool. Now we can fix the... 
the volume. It's very loud. I think I put on uh, windowed, but I didn't. Uh, is this better or is it t still a bit loud? Is it just me? Or does this do nothing? That did nothing. <laughs> That's weird. Okay, wait. Tell me if it's um, still too loud. And thank you, Tony, for saying this is a cozy screen. What the hell? I pulled it down to half and it's still so loud. How? I don't... <laughs> I don't understand. I think... I wonder... I'm just gonna check if there is... Um, if I can balance my microphone a bit. You only pulled music down? Yeah, but the music didn't do anything. Otherwise, it's dialogue and stuff. Uh, device properties. Okay, that's cool. Lower in sound settings. It's this... I, I tried. But it's like... I mean, do you hear any difference? There's no difference. Um, I mean, on your PC, I did. I put it in half, and it's still so loud. And I also pull it down on oh, OBS too. But if it's if it's still too loud, tell me, and I can pull it down even. It's like half of what games usually are. Oh crap. Poor our shepherd's just standing here. Oh, and the mouse is very sensitive. Okay. New game, new things to do. Um. Four thirty PM, that's awesome. Wait, where are you if it's already 4.30 p.m.? And also, hey, I want to be here. Come on, baby, hold together. Hold together. Joker. Oh, here we go. Australia. Okay, that makes so much sense. I don't know why my... Hmm. Maybe I'm talking extra quiet today. Talk to Joker. Faster. Come on, Joker. We have to get out of here. No, I won't abandon the Normandy. I can still save her. The Normandy's dead, just like us if we don't get the hell out of here. No, we just have to... Oh, no. They're coming around for another attack. Just get out. Oh no, the air. We dead. Pretty much dead. He has brittle bones, yes. Mm. Big ribs, yes. Hey, big cheese. How are you doing? Mass Effect 2. Heck yes. <laughs> so hype. 
your shortest game in history. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of funny. A bit weeks. Uh, Mass Effect Genesis is an interactive comic that summary. Ooh! Do we? That sounds fun. I want to. Interactive backstory comic. Oh, it's Dark Horse Comics? I have a huge Witcher book by them. That's very good. Just another routine mission. Why do they always say that before a mission? Of course it's routine. You haven't done anything yet. I hope it will be evil. It's everything that happens along the way. The choices you make. The paths you choose. That turn the routine into anything but. Of course, that's how it started. A routine mission. Answering a distress call. And look where that got me. Dead. We were testing out the Normandy, Captain Anderson's new ship, when the distress call came in. An Alliance patrol on Eden Prime had been attacked. They'd seen something they couldn't explain. And whatever it was, it was massive. I hit the ground with my lieutenant, Caden Alenko. A good kid. Loyal, by the book, with a talent for biotics. Boring. We came across the lone survivor <laughs> of the patrol, Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams. A soldier to the core. Tough, disciplined, ready to take on whatever came her way. Ashley joined up with us and took us to the spot where she lost her squad. That's when we saw it. A ship. Like nothing I'd ever seen. It was massive. Scorching the colony and everything around it as it blasted away. This is we pretty followed cool. the path of destruction to an artifact. A beacon left by a long dead race called the Protheans. The colony had dug it up and whoever attacked them had tried to take it. Lieutenant Alenko made the mistake of getting too close. I hit him with some type of energy. I grabbed him and threw him out of the way. That's when it hit me. Hard. Every muscle in my body went rigid. I couldn't move. Could barely breathe. Everything went black. And then I saw something. A vision. A dream. A nightmare. By the time I woke up, we were halfway to the Citadel on our way to meet the Council. I was expected to explain what I'd seen. I mean, we all Anderson know this because it wasn't that long so since we Dina, played Mass Effect 1. It was like a couple of days. On the Citadel. With those two heavyweights, really like it, it seemed reasonable we could persuade the Council that the ship we'd seen was a potential threat. As was the individual behind the attacks. The main suspect for the Eden Prime Massacre was a Turian Spectre named Saren. He'd been seen by one of the survivors from the colony at Eden Prime, and there was some evidence to suggest that the ship was connected to Saren. But even Udina's pointed accusations weren't enough to convince Why the council. Why did he throw him that way? He looks so evil. I mean, he is evil. Could be guilty of something like that. They needed proof, which meant I needed proof. Fortunately, I wasn't alone in my search. Garrus, another Turian, wanted to help. A top agent for Citadel security. Despite orders from his superiors that he shouldn't get involved, he told me he was suspicious of Saren and he had some useful leads. More importantly, he was Garrus. willing to share them. That led me to Rex, the biggest, nastiest looking Krogan bounty hunter I'd ever seen. <laughs> he also looks crazy. He turned out to be more than just a brute. It was his intel that led us to a fugitive with incriminating evidence on Saren. Still a dead game. I mean, we're the energetic little quarry named Tally. I mean, the depends on how you mean with that game. Hacking. She procured some information I don't on Saren. Because I don't think Saren. it's been dead, but evidence if you do, proved Saren was dirty. Then Tally's evidence proved that Saren was responsible for the massacre on Eden Prime. I don't know. And the immense oh. warship we'd spotted was in fact Saren's flagship, but it went much further. Saren was trying to find a way to bring back a race of sentient machines from dark space. Machines allegedly responsible for cleansing the galaxy of all organic life. These Reapers were blamed for wiping out all life 50,000 years ago, including the Protheans, and disappearing back through the mass relays to dark space, leaving no trace that they'd ever been. That explained why Saren was after the beacon, and it made some sense out of my visions. But not much else. Okay. I couldn't convince the council that the Reapers were a threat. But they agreed This Saren is gonna be like stopped. ten minutes long. <laughs> so I don't know if and we're gonna be the bored, but the first human specter. My first task? Yeah. Bring down Saren. 
Anderson decided to stay behind, giving up his ship, the Normandy. He told me I'd need it more than he would. He also pointed me in a direction. Liara. A Prothean expert, adept in biology. Nah, I feel like World of Warcraft after... Daughter of Benezia. After Legion, it's just been lieutenant. downhill. And like Legion Asari, was great. As beautiful as she is intelligent. And born with a unique ability to meld with other species. Yeah. But uh, Shadowlands is a bit boring. I'm, I'm playing a bit of, of TBC though, so that's me. fun. Nothing concrete, but it gave me some clues. And a new appreciation for the Asari. Her technique for accessing my vision was unexpected. Who did your and romance in the first one? Liara. I was a little concerned about the connection I shared with Liara. As commander, I knew either relationship had the potential to interfere with the mission. I told Liara about how I felt. I don't know how, if you're gonna feel that too. way when I explain my we plan to you. Let it get in the but way of okay. <laughs> finding Saren. Thanks to Liara's help, we had our next lead, Benezia. Saren had taken her to Novaria, where he enslaved the queen of a dangerous race of insects. Oh, this is gonna be so long, but I like it. You gotta tell me if you're bored. Order Benezia chat. to use the same technique Liara had used on me to extract information from the Rachni Queen. Queen's drones were everywhere, and they were not happy. We had to fight through hundreds of them to get to Benezia. By the time we arrived, Saren was gone with the information. I tried to reason with Benezia, but oh, Saren had indoctrinated her. He had somehow acquired the ability to control people's actions and wills. Benezia wouldn't surrender, and Liara was forced to watch her mother die in her arms. <laughs> right. And I was left with an angry, dangerous Rachni queen to deal with. This was the worst she choice. She her drones would do no harm if I released her. But the Rachni had terrorized the galaxy before. I couldn't take the chance. I had a mission to do. And an army of angry Rachni would be one more problem I didn't have time to deal with. With Saren's top lieutenant dead, he was quickly running out of time and places to hide. I tracked him down at his base on Vermeer. But we soon learned it was more than a base of operations. It was a breeding ground. Saren was breeding an army of Krogan. He'd found a cure for the genophage, a disease inflicted on the Krogan to prevent them from breeding and taking over the galaxy. But the Krogan Saren was breeding were slaves, mindless beasts that obeyed Saren's will. I had to destroy the base and all its research. Rex disagreed violently. Right, we missed this Rex entire the part. Age cure for his people. But because I, I just accidentally killed these people. These weren't real. But he wouldn't back down. Fortunately, Rex is smarter than he looks. He realized this wasn't the way to help his people and that Saren was the real threat. When we finally got to the center of the base, I realized just how close Saren was to completing his plan. He was already in communication with the Reapers. Sovereign, Saren's flagship we'd all assumed was just a ship, was a Reaper. It spoke to me, threatened me. I could feel the menace it had for every living thing. It wanted me dead. It wanted us all dead. And I knew it was capable of doing just that. What I couldn't understand was why Saren would help it. But there was no time to think about it. Sovereign knew where we were. We had to destroy the base and get the hell out. I split my team into two squads, sending Ash with one and Caden with the other as a distraction. We had a nuke and we planned to use it. Before we could detonate the bomb, Saren showed up. On we a fought. skateboard. I stalled him to make time for my team. And in talking to him, I realized the truth. It wasn't Saren who was indoctrinating everyone. It was Sovereign, the Reaper. And Saren was in deeper than all of them. He it was to convince the me he was still in control. Said he'd found a way to reduce the Reaper's influence. But he was kidding himself. Or believing the lies Sovereign was telling him. Before I could convince him to stop, he ran. Leaving me just seconds to extract my squad mates. I tried. Oh, yeah. But it wasn't fast enough. I could only save one of them. Caden was a good man. And a great soldier. We chose Ashley. But I had to choose. He's way more I evil. Ash. That was the last time Saren would slip away from me. I knew that. That was the only reason. The next time we She's met, just way one too of evil. Die. So with my team mostly in town, <laughs> we chased Saren and his army to Ilos, a long lost planet that had once belonged to the Protheans. As we prepared for what we knew would be a desperate fight, I spoke to my crew. 
We were just one ship against Saren's growing army. I assured them all that despite the odds, we could defeat him. Liara saw through my words. She knew I was hurting after Caden's death. She could sense my doubts. We, did, we had no doubts. We both knew this mission could be our last. Until that moment, we put our feelings aside for the sake of the mission. But why wait? We gave in to each other. And it was perfect. While it lasted. We arrived on Isla's close behind Saren. Once on the planet, we discovered a Prothean databank that helped me put the final pieces of my vision together. The Reapers had come 50,000 years ago. And every 50,000 years before that. Each time purging the galaxy of life. The Protheans had fought and died like oh, every right. species before them. I remember but we were like, long but why? Why do they do that? And the game the was Protheans basically just like, the I wouldn't the understand. To the mass <laughs> there wasn't an explanation. By sabotaging the Citadel, <laughs> they found a way to close the relays to dark space. Slowing the so I kind of wanted to know why. <laughs> the time we needed to find a solution to stop the Reapers once and for all. Saren knew this. He was leading his army to take control of the Citadel and re-establish the relays to Dark Space. Bringing the waiting Reapers here to destroy us all. We followed him to the Citadel. It was intact, but heavily damaged. What is that he jumping the move? Fleets by surprise <laughs> that is awesome. Now the... and with is that Saren or Garrus? There was little hope that the fleets could counterattack with enough strength to take back the Citadel. But Saren was done running. And I was done chasing him. Is Garrus? As the Alliance and Council fleets battled Saren's army outside the Citadel, I cornered the Turian bastard in the Citadel oh, Tower. Oh, that's cool! I wonder if they did that because... He died believing that the Reapers would We save had him. Garrus with us on the mission. As I fought to regain control yeah. of the Citadel, the Council's flagship, the Destiny Ascension, fell under attack. Despite Saren's death, Sovereign and Saren's army continued to fight. The Council was aboard the Destiny Ascension and they were requesting assistance. But I knew in order to help them, I would have to put our human alliance fleet in jeopardy. Yeah, we're not doing that. The council could be replaced. <laughs> the fleets were needed here and now if we were going to defeat Sovereign. Even with the Citadel back in my control, Saren defeated and the Normandy leading the combined galactic fleet. The battle against Sovereign, a single Reaper, was relentless. It took the combined fleets of humanity and the other races. But in the end, Sovereign fell. But the costs were immense. While humanity's efforts in the war earned us our first seat on the Council, it was a hollow victory. The Reapers were still out there. I knew the fight was far from over, but... As the one who'd led the fight against Saren, I was given new responsibilities. The choice of humanity's first counselor was left to me to decide. On the one hand, Udina, the lifetime politician, ruthless and ambitious, he would easily navigate the political landmines that would soon be placed before him. The other choice, Captain Anderson, the career soldier. Tough but fair, but a friend and someone I could trust. Both great leaders in their own right. I didn't much like Udina, but sometimes you need a pit bull on your side. Someone willing to be the bad guy for the sake of the greater good. The war was over, the threat had passed. In time, the Council would rebuild itself. The Citadel could be repaired. Even the pain of lost friends would fade. But none of that mattered if the Reapers were still out there. And if they were all <laughs> hey, cranky with Krogan, Sovereign, we had to What's find up? a way to stop them. How you doing? I had to find a way. I gathered my crew, took my ship, and went in search of answers. Officially, the Council would only say I was assigned cleanup duty. Routing out any remnants of Saren's army. Just another routine mission. Yeah. I'd like to think that this is like our shepherd retelling everything that happened, but in a way to make it sound more good. But actually, we all know that was not really exactly how it happened because we were very evil. Yes, that was like previous. Commander Shepard has been recovered. That was it. The Lazarus Project will proceed as planned. Ew. I don't like it. See, 
Deep Lawal, thank you so much. And thank you for subscribing on your first day of joining a stream. That's insane. Thank you so much. Have a great day in the sun and see you next time. Bye bye. <laughs> You played all three games before? I have only played the first two, but I don't know if I've finished two, to be honest. It was such a long time ago, so I don't uh, remember anything. I'm not sure if we should go with default appearance or if we should do custom, but in the meantime, I'm just gonna uh, run to the... Oh, shit. I wish I could. Okay, I'm just gonna run to the bathroom and then I'll be right back. Okay, BRB quickly. I am back. Hello. Uh, so what do you think, chat? Default appearance or uh, should we custom? I kind of want to try and custom and just see. Oh yeah, there's a lot. You know what? We're just going to go with default because it looks really good and I like it. Oh, nice! We can change. So we can't change name, but we'll, we'll just pretend her name is Karen, okay? Ah, oh, shit! So now we gotta choose this. Interesting. So, if you remember the last game, I I kind of said that I preferred. Um. I preferred just using the guns. Uh, I've spent over two hours on customizing. screen. I usually do too, that's why I'm like, no, don't. <laughs> uh, engineer can spawn combat drones. Oh, that's pretty cool. Combat drones, overload, incinerate. I kind of like engineer, but... Uh, adept is just super biotic. Sentinel is armor. Tech armor, throw up, overload, cry. I wonder if we should do Sentinel. Sentinel sounds pretty cool. I'm thinking Sentinel or Soldier. Because Soldiers is just guns. I kind of like that. Just guns. Vanguard was okay, but I know. You're gonna need overload for shields and warp for armor. Wait, what do you mean? 
Sentinel has both. Okay. Mm. Let's try Sentinel. Well, let's try that. Hey, Morpheus, how are you doing? Oh, can we change name? We cannot. Oh, shit. A tank, basically. I like that. So, are you guys cool with us going with a default appearance for this one and not going with a custom? Let's say she had a bit of a makeover. She does look evil still like this. Okay, you guys, you, you better be cool with it. Confirm. Couldn't change. She looks very high. <laughs> True. Something's wrong. She's reacting to outside stimuli. Nah, she doesn't need to be pretty. Oh my god, Miranda. I think she's waking up. Damn it, Watson. She's not ready yet. Give her the sedative. Shepard, don't try to move. Just lie still. Try to stay calm. Heart rate's still climbing. Brain activity is off the charts. Stats pushing into the red zone. It's not working. Another dose. Now. How do you like your coffee? Heart just just black. Stats falling yeah. back in the normal range. We almost lost her. I forgot about her. Run the numbers again. Should we romance her? Nah, Garris. Wake up, Commander. She does look a bit evil. Shepard, do you hear me? Get out of that bed now. This facility is under attack. Shepard, your scars aren't healed, but I need you to get moving. This facility is under attack. Oh, she looks really evil. I love it. Perfect. So apparently, uh, in this game compared to, you don't have time to wait around, Shepard. Grab your weapon and armor. This pistol doesn't this... have a thermal clip. It's a med bay. We'll get you a clip from. Damn it! Those canisters by the door are going to blow. Get behind cover now. Okay. Keep your head down, Shepard. Shield yourself from the blast. Everybody should be buying these kind of games. I don't agree because that's that's so unrealistic. Like not everyone's buying in real life, you know. Thermal clip. Okay, what I was gonna say is they apparently dramatically reduced the amount of butt shots in this Mass Effect compared to the OG version, which I think is probably a good choice. I'm just gonna um, see if I can. Did it do it? Yeah, okay. It's very sensitive still? Games being realistic, true. No, what happened? Oh, okay, sorry. Sorry. Yes, okay. Yes, keep these settings. It's still a full screen. Why? No, what am I doing? Sorry. Having some issues. It's not the dress. Okay, whatever. Find a thermal clip and get moving. Okay. She's bossing me around so much. Looks like they set up a barricade to try holding the mechs off. Oh. Look out. Keep moving, we need to get to the shuttles. This game feels way different from the first one. Also, as always, tell me if it's too loud, too quiet, too anything. You know. Can I pick that up? No. The sense is so high, even though I have it at like 10%. Okay, take cover. Where? Oh, here. Place better? I'm not sure yet. Maybe? Oh. They're through my shields! Oh, it's just the shields? Headhunter. Nice work, Shepard. Coast is clear. 
Can I pick this up? Yes. Seems I can only pick them up if I need them. So there, there wasn't any reloading in the last game, but it is in this one. Oh! Scary. Okay. Grenade launcher. Use the Wait, what do I do? Oh. Take the elevator down one floor. Don't tell me everything to do. God damn it. Okay, relax. Oh! <laughs> Great. Uh, data logs? Slow, but subject shows signs of recovery. Major organs are again functional and there are signs of rudimentary neurological activity. In an effort to accelerate the process, Oops. we've moved from simple organic reconstruction of the subject to biosynthetic fusion. Initial results show promise. Cool. I like it when the logs are voiced, so I don't have to read them out loud. That's very nice. The cost of this project is astronomical. Over 4 billion credits so far. But nobody seems to care that we've gone over budget. I don't know where the boss Cafe? gets all this money. Then... Maybe it's better not I'm to like know. Better. <laughs> I just wish he'd kick a little more <laughs> Go than get some coffee then. Coffee's so good. There's no excuse to not have coffee, you know. So, unless you're like... No, no excuse. The remastered graphics are super good. This, yeah, this looks great. This looks really nice. I love it. Oh, hello? Oh. <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> that was a bit mech. Mech. You don't need to do a grenade launcher on a human. That was a bit <laughs> over the key overkill. Gotta get some lip gloss. No, lip bomb. Lip seal. She is just a pure cold hearted bitch. Okay. Rude. Spot. <laughs> yeah. Incoming. Okay. Oh. Sorry. you were still a work in progress are you with miranda yeah sorry i forgot this is all new to you right now i'm jacob taylor i've been stationed here for hostiles detected damn it nice things must be worse than i thought if miranda's got you running around i'll fill you in but we better get you to the shuttle first uh Ever since I woke up, someone's been telling me where to go and what to do. I need answers. <laughs> Fair enough. I'll give you the quick version. You and your ship were attacked and destroyed. You were killed. Dead as dead can be when they brought you here. Dead. Our scientists spent the last two years putting you back together. You've been comatose. Or worse, that whole time. Welcome back to your life. That's a... I'm having trouble wrapping my head around this. Yeah, I can imagine. The Alliance officially declared you killed in action. The whole galaxy thinks you're dead. And if we don't get to those shuttles, they'll be right. Were there any other survivors from the Normandy? I'll tell you what. You help me finish off these mechs, and I'll play 20 questions with you all day. Cool. Low on thermal clips, but I'm a biotic. Just give the order when you want me to hit them with the good stuff. Can't you just do it by yourself? <laughs> oh, we got Renegade, nice. Full power. Nice. Falling back. Ah, oh, 
all that okay. work? Good. I promised I'd answer your questions. Nice, nice, nice. What do you want to know? Uh, do I want to know anything? You know what? No. What's the quickest way to those shuttles? Depends where the mechs are thickest. It's probably best if we- Check, check. Anyone on this frequency? Anybody still alive out there? Hello? Wilson, this is Jacob. I'm here with Commander Shepard. Just took out a wave of mechs over in D-Wing. Shepard's alive? How the hell? Never mind. You need to get her out of there. Get to the service tunnels and head for the network control room. Roger that, Wilson. Stay on this frequency. I think I remember a Wilson checking on me one time when I woke up. Why is her That's face him. like crap? He's the chief medical tech. Answers directly to Miranda. Come on. The service tunnels are this way. Is that because we are... we were dead? Maybe we should have asked him questions. But uh, we just keep that. I feel like my shepherd don't phase. care so much. It She's just like... Two years, but we did it. <laughs> She doesn't really care so much, you know. She's just like, whatever. Just get sh get shit done. Damn it, Wilson. This room is crawling with mechs. The whole station is crawling with mechs. I'm doing the best I can. Do better. Wilson, find us another route. Oh god, they found me. Help. Wilson. The face will get worse with Renegade. Really? They're out of control. Up those stairs, Shepard. I didn't know it had a impact on appearance. That's awesome. Ooh. Shepard, down here. Hello. Bastards got me in the leg. You were there the first time I regained consciousness. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> How about we talk about this after we fix my leg? He's gonna Should slow us down. Should be in the first aid station on the wall. Hopefully there's enough to get him up and moving again. Grab the metagel from the first aid station on the wall. Okay. I was thinking... Oh well. It's such a big upgrade? Yes. Uh, move your mouse to unity power? Oh. I thought there would Thanks, be an option to... <laughs> Never thought you'd save my life. To let him down. That makes us even now. Hmm? I thought maybe I could shut down the security mechs, but whoever did this fried the whole system. Completely irreversible. We didn't ask what you were doing. Why do you even have security mech clearance? You were in the bio wing. Weren't you listening? I came here to try and fix this. Besides, I was shot. How do you explain that? I don't care who set up who. Those mechs are shooting at all of us. We'll sort it out later. Yeah. We need to find Miranda first. We can't just leave her behind. Forget about Miranda. She was over in D-Wing. The mechs were all over that sector. There's no way she survived. A bunch of mechs won't drop Miranda. She's alive. Then where is she? Why haven't we heard from her? There are only two possible explanations. She's either dead, or she's a traitor. Haven't known her long enough to trust her. This project was Miranda's baby. She'd never sabotage it. Okay, maybe she's not a traitor. But that doesn't change the facts. We're here, she's not. We need to save ourselves. The shuttle bay is only a few. Uh oh. We can okay. The Give me a second, chat. I'm just gonna uh, bring up. Uh, nice. Go, go, go. Nice. Oh, there was a hole? Okay. The How do I... Way to the shuttles is through those canisters. Oh. Oh. Overload? Oh. Nice. Got it. Okay, we took him down. But this is getting tense. Shepard, if I tell you who we work for, will you trust me? No. <laughs> this really isn't the time, Jacob. We won't make it if she's expecting a shot in the back. If you want to piss off the boss, it's your ass, Jacob. The Lazarus Project. The program that rebuilt... Oh, what is happening? ...controlled by Cerberus. 
Should I recognize that name? Mm hmm. Maybe that's a side effect of your recovery. You and Cerberus certainly have a history. According to the Alliance, we're a radical pro human splinter group. We wiped oh. out several of our research bases. But things change. Didn't we kill them? The Alliance them? declared you dead. They gave All of up. them? Cerberus spent a fortune to bring you back. Look, I'd be suspicious too. But right now we have to work together. Weren't I thought you deserved that those to people on the base that we just killed all of them? Once we're off the station, I'll take you to the elusive. Why man. would they help us? He'll explain everything. I promise. Elusive man. Is he in charge of all this? Yeah. That's not his real name, of course. Nobody knows who he really is. It was a code name the Alliance used for him. Kinda stuck. I don't care what his name is, he just needs to answer my questions. All of them. <laughs> so Spent angry. A lot of money and time bringing you back. I'm sure he'll. Oh, sorry. I didn't think. Okay. Data pad. Oh, here. So, how do you like it so far, guys? How are you enjoying it? Saving content. Nice. You've been nice. spotted. Me too. Have a nice trip. Have a nice trip. What is that? <laughs> is that his catchphrase? Oh, I don't have any. I don't have any ammo. Okay. Well, well, I guess then. No shield Have a nice trip. Oops. Um. Great. Can I get some ammo? Test subject has been recovered, but the damage is far worse than You love it, me too. In addition to the expected burns and Great. internal injuries. Good the morning, trauma, Sleeper. Wilson assures me subject is salvageable. The How are you doing? Will proceed as planned. How are you doing? Where can I get some ammo? <laughs> Am I wasting too much? Is the game thinking I should not need more? Because it's kind of problematic that I have no ammo already. <laughs> I feel like that's not great. What is this? Like Resident Evil? Um. Oh, here's some. Nice. Thank you. Uh, get in here maybe? Yes. Yes. Okay. Cool. Come on. Through here. We're almost at the... Miranda, but you are... Oh! Dead. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> uh, it's uh, 11 here. Wilson betrayed us all. It, it's 11 here. I am in Sweden. And I'm playing Sentinel. I had a feeling Wilson was just looking for a chance to shoot me in the back. Good instincts. Some people are far too trusting to ever see that coming. Come on, let's grab this shuttle and get out of here. My boss wants to speak to you. You mean the elusive man? I know you work for Cerberus. Ah, Jacob. I should have known your conscience would get the better of you. Lying to the commander isn't the way to get her to join our cause. Well, since we're getting everything out in the open, is there anything else you want to ask before we go, Commander? Can we say something evil? You're the Lazarus Project's director, aren't you? That's right. I put two years of my life into this project. Into you. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> what does Cerberus want from me? Maybe you should ask the elusive man when you meet him. He poured virtually unlimited resources into Lazarus. Obviously, he has some kind of plan for you. Convenient that you show up as we're leaving. Mm -hmm. Where were you during the attack? Besides trying to save your life? Wilson figured out I was helping you and he sent an army of mechs to take me out. I got here as soon as I could. Probably a little too soon if you ask Wilson. What about the rest of the people on the station? This is the evac area. If they're not here now, they're not coming. Where are we going? Another Cerberus facility. The elusive man is waiting for you there. 
Not sure I trust you. This is the only shuttle off the station. You want to stay and rot with the mechs? Be my guest. I've had enough of this station to last a lifetime. Or two, in your case. Come on. Let's go. Ugh, my back is hurting a bit. That's why I'm like... I don't know. Moving around. I'm trying to sit in a way that doesn't hurt, but... No success so far. Before you meet with the elusive man, we need to ask a few questions to evaluate your condition. Come on, Miranda. More tests? Shepard took down those mechs without any trouble. That has to be good enough. It's been two years since the attack. The elusive man needs to know that Shepard's personality and memories are intact. Ask the questions. It would be kind of fun. I think I did that last time. It was like... We played really good. Or I played really good in Mass Effect 1. But then in Mass Effect 2, I was like, no, my uh, my personality is damaged and now I'm super evil. Did you say two years? Because that's kind of funny. <laughs> two slow years forward. and 12 How days. You and you were on an operating table for most of it. The sooner we start, the sooner we can be done. Start with personal history. Okay. Records show you were a colony kid. Lost your parents when slavers hit Mindwar. You enlisted and led troops during some heavy fighting, most notably on Torfin. Do you remember taking on some Batarian slavers? Oh. Those bastards were dug in deep in a fortified bunker. They sent a lot of good soldiers to their deaths. That's how it had to be. You got the job done. That's all that matters. Satisfied, Miranda? Almost. Let's try something more recent. Vermeer, where you destroyed Saren's cloning facility. You had to leave one of your squad behind to die in the blast. Lieutenant Caden Alenko was killed in action. It was your call. Why did you leave him behind? Oh no. Uh... Being in command means that sometimes you give orders knowing that your people are gonna die. That can't affect your decisions. Caden gave his life for the rest of the team. Without him, I couldn't have stopped Saren. He died a hero. I understand, Commander. And I wasn't judging your decision. Everybody at Cerberus knows that oh, cloning low facility energy had to day. be destroyed. Oh, that sucks, but then tests we really should run. Coffee's a good Come choice. Come on, Miranda. Enough with the quizzes. The memories are there, and I can vouch for Shepard's combat skills personally. I suppose you're right. We'll have to hope the elusive man accepts our little field test as evidence enough. Oh, she she does look. I I think she might be modeled after her. Now that you say so, I'm like, is she actually modeled after a real life person? Maybe. But she, I know who you mean, and I, yes. The elusive man is waiting for you in the other room. I wonder if, uh, she's Chuck's girlfriend? Yeah, isn't that the person in Handmaid's Trail? Oh shit, I need to Google. Okay, sorry. Uh, <laughs> Yvonne Stahovsky. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, 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 yes. She, uh, yeah. Nice one, Toddy. You just spotted that perfectly. Very impressive. That's so cool. Um, I haven't watched so much of The Handmaid's Tale because it's too, it's so depressing. It's so I depressing. Keep the elusive man waiting. I feel like I should watch more of it though because it's really good. Can you wife her in game? I don't think you can if you're a female. The chef. elusive man is waiting for you in the other room. Oh, armor. Oh, spooky. Oh, we can change that? Interesting. Casual appearance. What is the most evil casual appearance? What is this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. That's a dress. I, I kind of want- I feel like Evil Shepherd would wear this, but I feel like it's way more funny if she is evil in a hoodie, so <laughs> we're gonna be evil in a hoodie. That's- that's what's gonna happen. Flight attendant? No, is it good? I heard it was pretty good. How did he even get Martin Sheen for this? It is Martin Sheen, right? How did he do that? 
Commander Shepard. Elusive man. I thought we'd be meeting face to face. Unnecessary How? precaution. Not unusual for people who know what you and I know. How did he get Martin Sheen? What the hell? From what I hear, I cost you a fortune. Why'd you do it? For the defense and preservation of humanity. I didn't spend two years and billions of credits bringing you back to serve as a common soldier. But humanity is up against the greatest threat of our brief existence. The Reapers. Good to see your memory still intact. How are you feeling? Ooh, that makes me want to watch it. I want to be pro. I really want to watch There's this new thing on Netflix, which looks really weird, which is called Sweet Tooth, which is about a boy who looks like a deer in a post-apocalyptic world or something. It looks very interesting. <laughs> I really want to watch that. Uh... Cut to the chase. What are the Reapers doing that made you decide to bring me back? We're at war. No one wants to admit it, but humanity is under attack. While you've been sleeping, entire colonies have been disappearing. Human colonies. We believe it's someone working for the Reapers, just as Saren and the Geth ate its sovereign. You've seen it yourself. You bested all of them. That's just one reason we chose you. Fighting a war doesn't seem like Cerberus. Why are you involved? We're committed to the advancement and preservation of humanity. If the Reapers are targeting us, trying to wipe us out, Cerberus will stop them. If we wait for politicians or the Alliance to act, no more human colonies will be left. Sovereign was trying to harvest all life in the galaxy. Why would the Reapers target a few human colonies? Hundreds of thousands of colonists have vanished. I'd say that fits the definition of harvesting. Nobody's paying attention because it's random, and the attacks occur in remote locations. I don't know why they've suddenly targeted humanity. Maybe you got their attention when you killed one of them. Mm-hmm. You could have trained an entire army for what you spent to bring me back. You're unique. Not just in ability or what you've experienced, but in what you represent. You stood for humanity at a key moment. You're more than a soldier. You're a symbol. And I don't know if the Reapers understand fear, but you killed one. They have to respect that. If you're after the Reapers, just point me in the right direction. Miranda was worried you'd be resistant. She's not usually wrong. <laughs> so are just like, whatever, if I can kill things... I have things. a shuttle ready to take you to Freedom's yes. Progress, <laughs> the latest colony to be abducted. Miranda and Jacob will brief you. Miranda killed Wilson in cold blood. Jacob's just a gun for hire. You expect me to trust them? Wilson was one of my best agents, but he was a traitor. Miranda did exactly what I expected of her. And she saved your life in more ways than one. Jacob's a soldier, one of the best. He's never fully trusted me, but he's always been honest about it. This is You'll so be just well fine with them. For now. Okay. I'll get what you're looking for and be back before you know it. Good to hear it. Find any clues you can. Who's abducting the colonies? Do you don't like Miranda? The Reapers? I brought you back. It's up to you to do the rest. Why not? Okay. Uh, squad, squad point. Okay. Uh, pick armor. Uh, purchase ring. Uh, okay, cryo blast. Oh, I'm just okay. Uh. I don't understand how any of this work. Look, we're already doing good on the Renegade. No particular reason. <laughs> well, it's fine. Good, you're honest. What the hell? Okay, fine. Whatever. I can't do anything. Great. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Hey, Dams, how are you doing? Oh. Did he have voiced once again? Biotics is the oh, ability of Oh, that's awesome. That's so cool that they have voiced the uh, like what do you what did he call it? Wait, what did he call it? Codex. Voiced codex. Very cool. But I heard her name and I instantly dislike her. Miranda. Miranda is a good evil name, to be honest. It is a good evil name. 
The elusive man I'm is very good. impressed Thanks with for you. Asking. I'm eager to see if you can live up to his expectations on this mission. <laughs> you sound jealous. What's the matter, Lawson? Worried you're not his favorite anymore? <laughs> I've proven my value to the elusive man. Let's hope you're able to do the same. Are you naturally this bitchy, or is it just me? I have the <laughs> utmost respect for your abilities, Shepard. It's well. your motivations that concern me. I believe in what Cerberus stands for. Only time will tell if you prove to be an asset or a liability to our cause. That sounds awesome, bro. That sounds really nice. It is so warm here. I kind of want to go outside, but I'm gonna go out in a little bit. What can you tell me about this colony we're going to? Freedom's Progress? It's a typical human settlement in the Terminus systems. They had a small military force for protection supplemented by mechs and security drones. Average in almost every way, really. Completely unremarkable. Until the disappearance. Any thoughts on what we might run into there? A lot of empty buildings and one giant mystery. I'd like to know more about the Lazarus Project from the person in charge. I wasn't in charge. The elusive man was. If I was running the show, we'd have done a few things differently. What would you have changed? To start, I would have implanted you with some type of control chip. But the elusive man wouldn't allow it. He oh, was it's afraid so it might affect yeah. your personality, alter your character somehow. He wouldn't let us do anything that might limit your potential in any way. Can't say I like the idea of being brought back to life with a control chip in my brain. The elusive man is taking an incredible risk with you. I just hope his gamble pays off. It's obvious you're not interested hey, in talking. Strictly nine. We've got an assignment. It's emo, we right? can talk about it or we can do it. I'm glad the elusive man convinced you to join us, Commander. Cerberus gave me my body back. That's worth giving them a chance. One chance. But you're still not convinced. Do you trust me, Commander? We romance Liara. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Yeah, we romance Liara. And, uh... Because there, there wasn't, like, an evil op... Uh... It wasn't, like, an evil option to... To... To romance anyone? Like, you couldn't romance anyone and be evil about it? Is what I'm trying to say. So... Kind of the plan for romancing in this game is we romanced um, Liara all the way through in the first game. And I think the really evil option is if we are in this game, when we meet her, we're just going to be like, who? Sorry, I don't remember you. Who are you? Uh, no, sorry. And then she will be really sad and then we'll romance someone else. <laughs> Which I think is a good idea. You're part of Cerberus. I'll be keeping an eye on you too. Fair enough. I can't I think expect we were you to trust me evil. just because I ask you. I'll just have to earn that trust. Sure. Uh... That's all for now. Yes, ma'am. Oh, calling me ma'am. So polite. So nice. Okay, level up. We already. It's loud. So loud. Liara's a sweetheart. Yeah, that's why we can't romance her. It makes no sense. Shortly, Shepard. The elusive man put us under your command. Do you have any orders? We're gonna find out who did this and take them down. Nothing gets in our way. Am I clear? <laughs> Perfectly, Commander. Good to have you here, Shepard. Also, guys, I have played this before, but I remember literally nothing at all. So no spoilers, or you will be perma-banned forever. Okay, that's the rules. Spoiler and banned forever. <laughs> Renegade, nice. Yeah, I already knew about the face. That's fine. But I actually do remember this mission a little bit. A little bit. Looks like everyone just got up and left right in the middle of dinner. Pretty sure everyone dies. If we're in charge, then yes, probably. Things and stuff happen in the game. Oh no, Slater, are you gone? Strange. No bodies, no structural damage, and no signs of battle. Um. Hello? No? Hello? Oh, what are you shooting at? Oh. Security systems were disabled at the other colonies. I 
kind of wanna. Can I remove abilities that aren't my own? There we go. Make activity. Shoot them before they take out. Oops. I'm not doing so good. Whoops. Uh, we saved Ashley because it was clearly the more. Ashley is clearly evil. So that was clearly the more evil option. If you want to see like all the choices and stuff we made, you can go back to the beginning of the stream. We did like an entire. There's like a repack comic that you can. Uh, repack? Repack? What am I saying? Recap. There's a recap comic. They can watch. Oh no, is this game gonna turn into like a cover shooter? Because I'm not super into that. Target down. Oh! Hello. They should have recognized us as human. Someone reprogrammed them to attack on site. We're not alone here. Okay. Not alone. Oh, that's a glass. Can I destroy it? If I can destroy it, this is an awesome game. If not. Ah. Lame. Med kit. Highlight individual notes to find matching symbols. When you found two matching symbols, select them to complete the circuit. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh. I see. Let me try it again. I see, okay. It's memory. Wait. This is a bit more fun than the previous one. 2,000 credits. That's a lot. It's a lot of money. Alert. What are you hyped for at E3? I am also hyped for it, but I don't really have anything specific oh, right I'm looking there. forward to. Praza, you said you'd let me handle Oh, Tali. Wait. Shepard? I'm not taking any chances with Cerberus operatives. Put those weapons down! Shepard? Is that... You're alive? Tally Zora, you served on my ship. You know what I'd do to people who threaten me. <laughs> Praza, tell your team to put their weapons away. Damn it, Tally, this is bullshit. Why would your own commander work for Cerberus? I don't know. But if this is Shepard, I don't know. Shepard would have a reason. I know Cerberus has a bad past, but they're the only group investigating these missing colonies. The Council turned its back on humanity. I haven't. Tally, you aren't seriously considering trusting Cerberus. I'm not trusting anyone, Praza. But we're going to need help searching the area. One of our people was here on pilgrimage. His name was Vitor. We came to find him. Everyone else is dead. What makes you think Vitor survived? We saw him when we landed. You saw him? Then why isn't he with you? Are they all already? Russian? Vitor was injured, and he was She's always not Russian. Uh, nervous. Right? Which means that he was unstable. Combine that with damage to his suit CO2 scrubbers and an infection he from sounds an open air exposure, and he's likely delirious. When he saw us landing, he hid in a warehouse on the far side of town. We suspect he also programmed the mechs to attack anything that moved. Or does she sound Russian? I don't know, I can't tell. You should head back to your ship, Tally. We'll let you know when we find Vitor. Like hell. I'm not letting Cerberus take over. Neither am I, Praza. I don't want to fight you, Shepard. But I can't just let Cerberus handle this. Besides, we need to work together. Head for the warehouse through the center of the colony. We'll circle around the far side and draw off some of the drones to clear you a path. Alright. Oh, no, maybe not. <laughs> Watched Dexter? No, I watched like two episodes or something. You expect us to do all the dirty work while you sneak in and grab Vitor? Not likely. We're better equipped for a frontal assault than they are, Commander. 
If we don't work together, we're not going to get past those mechs. We're moving out. If you want your answers, get to that warehouse. The quarians are an unexpected variable. They could help us, but I'd hope to keep an eye on them. I bet they're saying the same thing about us. Nice. Oh, Alright. It's weird they have so many, like, um... She said, what? What? Why did... Why do you mention that? It's weird comments. But yeah, she is uh, the girl in Handmaid's Tale we were talking about. But... I don't know if it's the same... Is it the same voice actor as it is the... Is it the same voice actor as as a uh, character model? Be careful, Shepard. There's a squad of security drones. Chat as well. Okay. Thanks for the warning. That's we'll cool. take care of them. I that's really cool that they have her in here, but I don't know why you guys are freaking out so much about that. As you should be freaking out about Martin Sheen. Holy shit. Martin Sheen is awesome. I don't know how they get Attention right! Take off. Oh, how they got him in here. I mean, she she is cool as well. I don't remember her name. But Martin Sheen is like a huge actor. That's... Oh no. That's crazy. Nice. Yeah, but still. Very impressive. Go, 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 go. Have you guys seen Apocalypse Now? That one is pretty cool. That's like the, overload on the one I can think of. Here's Overload on them? Oh my god. Ah. We go. yes. But you can do it. Why do I have to use Overload? Your ability. Get me down. Yes. It's not my ability. Yes. On my top three movies, really? Oh, that's cool. It's really good. It's just. It's very depressing. This. Come on, we can still catch them. Where am I going? This way? Dark AF, so dark. It always makes me feel like shit when I watch it, which is not. But that, I mean, that means it's good. I hate that it's... Ah, shit. How can they fly around and also hurt? That's really... They did want to get to Vito first. Get your squad into cover and I'll open the loading bay doors. We'll take cover by the doors. Shepard, I can say I point. haven't seen it. I should feel bad. You should watch it. If you're a movie buff slaver, I think you will like it. Um, also, tell me if the game is right. too loud, chat. I think it is maybe a little bit loud. Take point, Shepard. We'll cover the door. But you guys can tell me. Nah, okay, good. I remember this, this like mech fight. gonna be one tough son of a bitch to take down yeah why are they calling him henchmen goons would be more accurate i'm just gonna turn down the volume a bit for me too so i usually have like games on twice the volume is this but this is so loud so loud No, I didn't. Damn it, Shepard! On time! 
on target, yes. You're literally on the target, Jacob. You're literally on the top of him. Whoops, sorry, my computer is being crazy. Nice. Okay, uh, heal, I guess. I don't wanna. Uh, now what? Is that it? Okay. This is valuable. Assure afford shotgun research project. Okay. Cool. Is this Vidor? Monsters coming back. Max will protect. Safe from swarms. Have to hide. No monsters. No swarms. No, 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 no. Is he okay? Vitor? No, Vitor. Not here. Swarms can't find. Monsters coming. Have to hide. Hey, I'm talking to you. Great. We come all this way and our only witness is a babbling idiot. Swarms coming. Storm coming. Storm of swarms. Next. <laughs> Great. You're not one of them. You're human. They... they didn't find you? Who didn't find us? The... the monsters. The swarms. They took everyone. Why didn't the colonists fight back, Vitor? What happened? Hey, Titans. You How are you doing? Know. You didn't see. But I see everything. Looks like security footage. He must have pieced it together manually. What the hell is that? Yeah. My Bugs. God. I think it's a collector. Is that some kind of alien? <laughs> They're a species from somewhere beyond the Omega-4 relay. Uh, Only thank a few you. people have ever seen one in person. They usually work through intermediaries, like slavers or hired mercenaries. If they're involved with the Reapers somehow, it could explain what happened to the colonies. The Collectors have advanced technology. They could have a weapon that disables an entire settlement at once. The Seeker swarms. No one can hide. The Seekers find you, freeze you, then the monsters take you away. Hello? Why didn't the oh. Collectors take you? Swarms didn't find me. Monsters didn't know I was here. The Collectors aren't known for being careless. Maybe his Enviro suit kept him from showing up on their sensors. Or they were using technology specifically designed to detect humans. Only human colonies have been hit. Yay. Tell me more about these swarms. It's how they find you. Seeker clouds. Machines like tiny oh, they're insects. They're not. They uh, they're not real insects. They find you, then they sting you, freeze you. Sounds like hmm. miniature probes, maybe. Find victims, then immobilize them with a stasis field or nerve toxin. I want to know more about the collectors. Nobody knows much. They're so rare, a lot of people don't even believe they exist. More importantly, why are they abducting human colonists? What are they after? Maybe hey, the Fred, elusive food. Can How are you it out. doing? What happened next? The monsters took the people onto the ship, and then they left. The ship flew away. But they'll be back for me. No one escapes. I think that's probably all we're getting out of him, Commander. All right. What a waste of time. <laughs> so mean. Hey, Tiger fans. Uh, first playthrough. It's not, but I don't remember anything. Um, I, I, have, I have no memory of what's happening, so... Uh, if uh, <laughs> no spoilers, basically. Thank you, Red Hood. I appreciate it. We finally find a witness, and he's so off his nut he can't even tell us what he saw. I studied them, the monsters, the swarms. I recorded them with my Omni tool. Lots of readings, electromagnetic, dark energy. We need All to right. get this data to the elusive man. Grab the quarry and call the shuttle to come pick us up. What? Vitor is injured. He needs treatment, not an interrogation. We won't hurt him. We just need to see if he knows anything else. He'll be returned unharmed. Your people tried to betray us once already. If we give him to you, we'll never get the intel we need. Praza was an idiot, and he and his men paid for it. You're welcome to take Vitor's Omnitool data, but please, just let me take him. Yeah. Oh, maybe we want her... I mean, we want her to join us. Ah... Uh. 
I bought this recently and never played it. You should. It's so good. I mean, we... <laughs> hmm. We, we can ask if she wants to join us, I guess. You don't have to take Vitor and go. We could work together, just like old times. I'm still trying to accept that you're even alive. And you're with Cerberus. I've got responsibilities now. I've got a mission of my own. I can't walk away from that. Not even for you. Oh well, in that case... The people at Cerberus won't hurt him, Tally. You have my word. But we need that information, and it's clear the Quarians don't want to share. Damn it, Shepard! I trusted you! He'll be fine. We promise. But we have to find out all we can about the Collectors. Sorry. What? No! I don't understand! Oh. We need a pickup. Have a medbay standing by. Good luck, Shepard. I hope what you get from Vitor is worth it. Yeah, Big Cheese, but sometimes you can do evil options on right, that if you do the left option, it nothing, like, you can't, the evil option disappears. So, like, sometimes it moves it forward so that you can't be as evil, if that makes sense. Which sucks. Shepard, good work on Freedom's progress. Thank you. Unfortunately, the quarium you brought back didn't give us any useful information. He's too far gone. He'll be returned and, to the And, oh, yeah, if you, if you guys just joined... We're doing a renegade super evil playthrough, so that's why I'm, I'm like really trying to just pick the most evil options all the time. Why do I get the feeling you knew about them already? I had my suspicions, but I needed proof. The Collectors are enigmatic at best. They periodically travel to the Terminus systems, looking to gather seemingly unimportant items or specimens, usually in exchange for their technology. When their transactions are complete, they disappear. Yeah, pretty as much as tiger fangs, yes. <laughs> Back beyond the unmatched. Or just Omega be as rude relay. as possible. Until now, we've had no evidence of direct aggression by the collectors. Oh, that okay. Uh that, that um that's a lot of questions. Okay. Why is the Omega 4 relay unmapped? What do we know about it? Only that no ship passing through it has ever returned. I wanna go in. Our best guess is that the relay reacts differently to collector vessels, allowing them safe passage. Oh. If they can manipulate relays, that's just further evidence of the connection with the Reapers. Any ideas on why they've shifted their focus to humans? If they're agents for the Reapers, it could be any number of reasons. Obviously, humanity played a huge role in Sovereign's destruction. That might have been enough to draw their attention. What really concerns me is why they bother abducting the colonists. Once the humans are paralyzed, why not just kill them? That Martin Sheen's voice? It is! It is Kappa Jake, it's so cool. You're right. What are the collectors getting it's from awesome. these deals? The collectors aren't very This game is so high bonus. budget. The budget is like Generally they seek out species here. with rare genetic mutations <laughs> or abnormalities. They pay slavers and work groups exorbitant sums to obtain these specimens. And then they leave, but they've never talked to the single face? species before, and the previous sample sizes were in the dozens, not the tens of thousands. You're holding something back. How do you know the Reapers are involved? The patterns are there, buried in the data. The Consul and the Alliance want to believe the Reaper threat died with Sovereign. You and I know better. I won't wait until the Reapers are on the march. We need to take the fight to them. I hate waiting, but I'll need a team, a good one. I've already compiled a list of soldiers, scientists, and mercenaries. Oh, it's not? Okay. You'll get dossiers on the best of them. Finding them and convincing them to work with you could be challenging. Yeah, it's, you're a it's, natural it's, it's similar. I'll continue to track the collectors. When they make their next appearance, I'll notify you and your team. Be ready. I feel like he looks a little bit different. Aranda and Jacob aren't enough. How many do you need to keep me in check? I've made it clear to Miranda and Jacob that you're in charge. You decide who joins your squad. Everyone else on this list was chosen specifically for this mission. They're the best. <laughs> hey, Beast Code. <laughs> you worry about the collectors. I'll make sure my team's ready. Good. Two things before you go. First, head to Omega and find Morden Solus. He's a brilliant Solarian Oh, scientist. Solarians are awesome. Our intelligence suggests he may know how to counteract the Collector's paralyzing Seeker Swarms. Cool. Sounds good. Hey, and Darling. Darling, Darla. How are you doing? I, I don't know. Like. <laughs> I always say I your name like three best. times. Someone you I am good. How are you? 
I'm so happy to. We're on Mass Effect 2, and it's awesome. Hey, Commander. Just like old times, huh? I can't believe it's you, Joker. Look who's talking. I saw you get spaced. He's Got walking. Lucky, with a lot of strings attached. How'd you get here? Can he it walk? It all fell apart without you, Commander. Everything you stirred up, the Council just wanted it gone. The team was broken up, record sealed, and I was grounded. The Alliance took away the one thing that okay, mattered to me. Okay, it's not walking, yeah, joined Cerberus. You really trust the elusive man? Well, I don't trust anyone who makes more than I do. But they aren't all bad. Saved your life. Let me fly. And there's this. They only told me last night. Can we romance Joker? He was walking in the opening scene. I remember, that was so weird. But maybe he was always walking. I just assumed he didn't. Because of his riddle... Bones. Yes, that is Death Green. That is true. Blue, that's not very renegade of you. Oh, right. True. Should have gotten this in red instead. It's good to be home, huh, Commander? I guess we'll have to give her a name. Billy Eilish mom? I don't. I don't. I don't know who that is. Is her mom famous? Hey, mysteries! Good to see you too. How you doing? Happy you guys are here with me this Saturday, playing some Mass Effect Two. Uh, I have no idea who Billie Eilish mom is, so I I I I have no idea who. I, I know who Billie Eilish is, but I don't know who her mom is, so I think I, there will be no way of me for me to, to guess. But um, it's the same as if I was like, hey, yo guys, uh, Anders Andersson is in this, can you guess who he is? And you're like, who the hell is that? And I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if hoodie. hoodie is the best option. <laughs> is the best option. Welcome aboard the new Normandy, Commander. I've been looking over the dossiers. I'd strongly recommend starting by acquiring Morden Solus, the Salarian professor on Omega. Okay, then I'll do the opposite. We know the collectors use some type of advanced <laughs> technology to immobilize their victims. We'll need him to develop a countermeasure to protect us. Yeah. You still don't get it, do you? You're not in charge of this mission. I am. Operative Lawson makes a valid point, Shepard. Without the Professor, any encounter with the Collectors would result in failure. Who are you? I am the Normandy's artificial intelligence. The crew like to refer to me as Edie. Shut that thing down. I don't want it on my ship. I hate have it. I offended? Yes. Shepard spent a great deal of time fighting rogue AI. Geth, mostly. Plus that incident with the Alliance's Hannibal system on Luna. Your distrust is logical, Shepard. Unlike the irrational mistrust of most humans. However, I am no threat to you or anyone else. I observe and offer analysis and advice. Nothing more. I'm guessing it takes more than just the three of us plus Joker to fly this ship. Yeah, the I don't Normandy mind Jacob. I think he's They're at the okay. stations awaiting your orders. Final preparations for takeoff are complete, Commander. When you're ready to go, just pick a destination from the galaxy map and the CIC and I'll plot a course. Jacob and I should return to our posts. Come find us if you have any questions. Oh, okay. I mean, I think he is... He's like a better version of Caden. Okay, pick a new destination. Private terminal, armory... Alright, 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 alright. Got it. He does look a bit like Kanye West. I can I can admit that. Welcome aboard, Commander. Um so many things updated. Nice. Um Oh we can sprint in this game. Amazing. Um 
two options. I want to try that one because we only tried the previous one. There's so many guns here. Why can't I get one of these? Oh, more renegade. Wait, can I check? Uh, squad. Yes. There is a tiny bit of paragon, which I don't love, but okay. Uh, warp cryo. I don't know what cryoblast is. Oh, but I'll, I'll take one. But I. I don't understand. Oh, okay. Ignore me. How far into the game are you? We're just in the beginning. Commander, there hasn't been time to really settle in and take stock. I want to say that working with you is a great opportunity to do something that matters. It's a privilege to serve on the Normandy, Commander. You're here because you're Cerberus. Don't expect special treatment. Understood. But not everyone in the group is hardline. I'm an employee because I believe in their current direction. Doesn't mean I don't have concerns about their past actions. Or some of yours. Mine? What do you, you watch mean? watch me, I'll watch you. That suit you? If you follow orders and keep to yourself, we'll have no problems. Fair enough, Commander. Let me know if you need anything. I have done nothing wrong. Let me tell you. Also, Renegade plus Fortnite. Just, just so you know, uh, this stream... What's this area of the ship? The you know what? I don't care. This stream is gonna be a Let's bit shorter than usual. I'm trying to you out, keep streams a little bit sh shorter than usual, keep them more reasonable length. So we will end at about 2 p.m. ish. It's 12 p.m. now, so it's like two hours left. But just, just so you guys know, do you like Star Trek? I've never seen Star Trek, which I know sucks. Oh, cycle appearance. Oh. Oh, cool. Let's say give her that. That makes her look more badass. Oh, we can't cycle your appearance? Okay. Upgrades. About upgrades. Okay. Unread messages. Oh. So many. On the off chance that the rumors are true and you actually are alive, I need to come and talk to me on the Citadel. A lot has changed in the last two years. You put us on top and it's only fair that you allow us you be allowed to speak for yourself about what we've been hearing. Deal struck with Said Masani, lost contact with survey ship, Normandy Crassite, Recon Hood, Overlord, Art Projector. Okay, Mark is read. And Mark that one is read. Um, you may know the name Said, he has been involved in some of the best known and some utterly unknown military operations in the Terminus system and is feared as ruthless and servant as bounty hunter. Oh. Please come. I'm gonna, I'm gonna purge that. Cause no spoilers, you know. No spoilers. I know it's an old game, but no spoilers, anyways. Okay. Galaxy map. What else could I do? Did we walk back? Okay. Uh, Captain's cabin. Nice. This was not a thing before. But, oh, this is the same. So that's pretty cool. Oh, can we? Do I remember correctly that we can put fishes in the fish tank? Armor. Mm -hmm. Do we want helmet? I kind of like that one. We can't. Nice. Oh, we can't change anything here yet. We can change material and tint. I don't really care about that so much. Black looks coolest. Oh, full black. Can we go red? Eh, you know what? Ooh, that's pretty cool though. I like that. And red. Great. No, I didn't apply. Oh well. I'm not doing that again. How to win? No, look, I I don't know anything about. Oh, she talks about it in the beginning of the game. Oh, I didn't ask her about that. Guys, I don't know anything about the game. I have played it, but my memory, I'm I'm like a goldfish. I don't remember anything. So, no spoilers. I don't know what the suicide mission is. Or, how to win it. But I also don't want to know. 
Oh, it is. It did. It did say casual appearance. I still think the hoodie is the best. But no spoilers, chat. I don't want to know anything. No tips. No. No nothing. Basically, it's a big ship. Oh, she's a cutie. How old? Ah, uh, she'll be a year old next month. Oh, you'll miss her first birthday. This is where they sleep. The family lives in new camp. Women's restroom. Can I go into the men's restroom? Maybe not. It's a pretty nice restroom. Kind of creepy that you have the door entirely open and just look into the shower still, but I don't know. Med Bay. Hey, kill us game. How are you doing? Not a spoiler, you're on a suicide mission. It's literally the first conversation. Oh, okay. Well, in that case, that's fine. Chef surprise again. Fight. On, Rupert. Commander Shepard, the hero of the Citadel. You did humanity proud that day. As Sergeant Rupert Gardner here. How can I be of service? Uh... What do you do here on the Normandy? What don't I do? Most think of me as the ship's cook, but I'm also the facilities technician and custodian. Nice. HVAC, plumbing, non-mission critical electrical. I make sure they're all clean and running. So, the man cleaning the toilets is also preparing the meals? I wash my hands. Most of the time. <laughs> this ain't no luxury liner. You have to pull your own weight in a Cerberus vessel. And I catch what falls through the cracks. <laughs> through the cracks. Do you have everything you need? I make do. But have you ever tried to prepare a decent meal with military provisions? I'm good. What is happening no to the texture worker. in the back? Taking down the collectors okay, no. is going to be rough business. The crew deserves a few fine meals before they throw themselves into the fire. And we need to stay focused on our mission. There's no time for crew comfort. Of course. They're a determined group. No need for pampering. I won't take any more of your time. No pampering. Just make sure to bring like the best food to my uh, to my place, you know. You can give them whatever, but Bring the best food to my place, okay? I'm just gonna run to the bathroom really quickly and get some more water. So you better do that too, chat. Get some get some water, hydrate, whatever. BRB.
back. Okay, let's talk to Miranda. Hello? Commander, what can I do for you? Do you have a minute, Miranda? No doubt you've got a lot of questions. Cerberus isn't as evil as most people I thought believe. she had one really if thick eyebrow. I can help eyebrow. any of your concerns, I'd be happy to do so. So, what would you like to know? I know what we're doing here, but what's Cerberus' long-term goal? The advancement of the human race. Nothing more, nothing less. The Salarians have the special tasks group. The Asari have their legendary commandos for stealth and recon operations. Cerberus is humanity's answer to those organizations. Mm-hmm. But those organizations are regulated by governments. Who keeps Cerberus in check? Nobody. We're privately funded and our backers trust the elusive oh, man to make Elon the right Musk. decisions. But he's very clear about our goals. Protect humanity and serve its advancement. Tell me about yourself, Miranda. Oh, I guess that's fair. I've spent the last two years learning everything there is to know about you. Well, you should probably know that I've had extensive genetic modification. She looks way more Not evil decision, in this armor. But I make the most of it. It's one of the reasons the elusive man handpicked me. I'm very good at just about anything I choose to do. <laughs> elusive man is watching memes right now. Yes, and uh, Bitcoin. Uh... What level of genetic modification are we talking about? That's very thorough. Physically, I'm superior in many ways. I heal quickly and I'll likely live half again as long as the average human. My biotic abilities are also very advanced. For a human. Add to that some of the best training and education money can buy and... Well, it's pretty impressive, really. It sounds like you were designed to be perfect. Maybe. But I'm not. I'm still human, Shepard. I make mistakes like everyone else. And when I do, the consequences are severe. Everyone expects a lot from someone with my... abilities. You certainly don't lack for confidence. It's just a fact. My reflexes, my strength, even my looks, they're all designed to give me an edge. No point in hiding from it. It's the reason I'm trusted to oversee the most dangerous, risky, and technically demanding operations Cerberus undertakes. And it's why I was assigned to you. It's my job to make sure you succeed, Shepard. Oh, don't be creepy, Strictly9. Come on! Why do you have subtitles about the things you say? Because uh, it's. I think it's good for people who either have like hearing problems or people who don't aren't good at understanding English and stuff. It's nice to have subtitles, but if you don't like them, you can turn them off. It's just there for the people who prefer having subtitles on. What level of oh no! I already asked this. Shit, 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 shit. Add to shit. that some it of sounds the like you shit, shit, and when shit. I do, the consequences of, of Sorry. course, Commander. The... Whatever you need. Don't be peace forty nine. I know my um, my accent makes the subtitles not great unless I, if I articulate better, they usually turn more accurate. <laughs> but um. Yeah, <laughs> I don't always. Main the battery. Officer is required to access the gunnery control station. Uh -huh. Yeah, they 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 reduced the amount of butt shots in this game quite a lot, I think. What is this? Men's restroom. Oh, I can go inside? That's weird. Or well, I don't know. Depends on how much you care, I guess. <laughs> Scholar. Nice. What do we have in here? Engine room. Engineer talk to. Okay. Let's just go back up. Let's continue. I don't know why. I'm always like running around looking at everything. We don't need to do that. We can just we can just do the quest. We don't have to investigate everything. But I like it here. Combat Information Center. I like that the loading screens are so Joker quick. Would like to see you up on the bridge, Commander. Oh, okay. Oops. I don't like the sprint button and the select button are the same. Because it makes it so that I accidentally select things. Oh, what's happening why is it why does it look like that is that good can you believe this commander it's my baby better than new it fits me like a glove and leather seats military may set the hardware standard but on a first-gen frigate they could care less if the seats breathe civilian sector comfort by design 
Reproduction is not intended to be perfect, Mr. Moreau. Seamless improvements were made. And there's the downside. I liked the Normandy when she was beautiful and quiet. Now she's got this thing I don't want to talk about. It's like ship cancer. I don't trust them. We still need to move ahead, but it's all too convenient. Maybe you're right. I guess it's hard to argue when they install an AI to spy on us. We're staying though, right? I mean, this seat is real leather. Good to see you're keeping it all in perspective, Joker. Uh, leather? Was that all you wanted to talk about? Okay. Sure. Go, 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 go. Right. So, oh, okay. Fuel? I don't know. Five probes and fuel, I guess? Uh, recruit Archangel, the professor, recruit the veteran. What is this? Kairamuri. Oh! Oh! Uh, no. Go back. Enter. Go back. Oh, we can explore the Normandy crash site? Do we want to do that first? Or do we want to do these first? I don't know. It's kind of funny if we're just like, bye. We're gonna explore the Normandy crash site immediately. I kind of want to do that. We have exhausted our fuel supply. Okay. I will use FTL to get us to a fuel station. We cannot do that. Sure. Shit. Okay, we're going here. We don't have enough fuel. Enter orbit to Omega, built in the mind outhouse of a metallic aster asteroid. Omega has been a haven for criminal terrorists and malcontents for thousands of years. At times, the station has lay lain idle and abandoned for centuries, only to be reactivated by a new group of outlaws seeking a fresh start. The space station's original elegant design has given way to haphazard expansions. Uh by scrabbling factions of every species. There is no central government or unifying authority on Omega and nobody can recall a time where there ever was one. Population 7.8 million. Oh, so it's like Sweden. <laughs> cool. Nightclub time. Yay. <laughs> A A V G B L W A V G Gaming. Hello. How you doing? Where's my water? Cool cutscene. I guess we have to add her, add him. We could go alone, but that's not as fun. Oh, uh, what? Uh, overload is really handy. Just to go with that, I guess. And Jacob. Um. Yeah, just go with pool and that. And Shepard, we have no points. Okay. How long have we been playing? We just started. Okay. We just started. This is the first. The second mission, I guess? Hi. Welcome to Omega. You're new here, aren't you? I can always tell. Allow me to... Oh, hello, Mocklin. I was just... Leave, Fargot. Now. Oh, of course, Mocklin. Whatever she wants. Okay. Blasted scavengers. Welcome to Omega, Shepard. You know who I am? Of course. We had you tagged the moment you entered the Terminus systems. You're not as subtle as you think. Aria wants to know what brings a dead specter to Omega. I suggest you go to Afterlife now and present yourself. Hmm. I don't know what Diary of a Wimpy Kid is, or who Rowley and Greg are. I'll talk to your boss when I'm damn well ready. Then you'd better get ready. No one keeps Arya waiting. Afterlife, now. Progressive in, in what the way? Dr. Morton Solis runs the clinic. Anticipate resistance at the transport station. I have also accessed messages between mercenary groups regarding plans to deal What? <laughs> okay. Please. You have to help me. 
No one said you could talk, jackass. You Zaid Masani? Yeah, that's me. You must be Commander Shepard. I hear we have a galaxy to save. Well, I... Sorry, I think I, I missed something, but I don't know what you're talking about, Strictly Nine. Uh... I assume you've been briefed? I've done my homework. Cerberus sent me everything I needed to know. My contacts told me we're picking up one man, not two. Batarian delinquent. Pissed off someone rich enough to hire me to go after him. And for my bring him in alive raids, even. Please. I didn't do it. I said, <laughs> shut it. Tried to lead me on a chase all over the systems. He should have known better. These people always run to Omega. What's your relationship with Cerberus? Easy. Cerberus is paying me a lot of money to help you on your mission. That's the long and short. Not many mercs would take a suicide mission for the pay. Most mercs don't get an offer like the one Cerberus sent me. This mission doesn't sound like good business, but your elusive man can move a lot of credits. Go ahead and get set up on the Normandy. Right. I'll go make myself at home. Sound is really weird here. There's so much. I assume the elusive man Busting. told you about our arrangement. I'm assuming there's some part of your contract that I'm expected to handle. That about right? Yeah. Funny he didn't tell you. Picked up a mission a little while back, just before I signed on with Cerberus. Thought you might be interested. You heard the name Vito Santiago? He's the head of the Blue Suns. Runs the whole organization. Seems he recently captured an Elfell Ashland refinery on Zoya and is using their workers for slave labor. The company wants it dealt with. We'll get to it if we can. Our mission takes priority. I know you've got bigger fish to fry. That's why I'd like to get this other thing dealt with as soon as possible. <laughs> I like him. I better turn this thing in before it starts to stink. I'll be locked and loaded next time you're ready to get some killing done. I'm always ready to get some killing done. That's why we're playing space. Karen. Evil, evil, evil shepherd. That fire. <laughs> cool. Oh, I don't remember any of this. I'm so confused. Six renegade points. Transport. Omega, what a piss hole. At least it keeps you on your toes. It looks really I've had to cool. come here on business before. I feel like I need a shower afterward, in addition to normal decontamination. Okay, so we can go in here. We can also go over here. Apartments, marketplace. I mean, let's just go straight into the afterlife place. There seems to be a queue, but I don't give a shit. This is cool. Why does it look so much like the previous one? With the like round thing in the center. Maybe that's what bars have in space. They always have a center part. Hello. Give me a drink. <laughs> Walk away though. Terrians are so cool. It was so awkward. <laughs> Why completely quiet? Is it because it's too loud or something? Close enough. Keep drinking? Okay, let's do that. Oh. Okay. Stand still. Try it and you'll be scanning the inside of your colon. <laughs> I'd almost pay to see that, but it's not an option. You wanna talk? You get scanned. If you're looking for weapons, you're not doing a very good job. 
Can't be too careful with dead specters. That could be anyone wearing your face. Oh, I was told hey, the person to talk to. Hey, sushi. Sushi. They're clean. Thank you so much for the three months. Oh, and it's tier Depends three again. Questions. Holy crap. Run Omega. <laughs> That's a tier three sub. Guys, can we please get some... If you have hard emotes, please spam them up for... Oh, I cannot. I am Omega. <laughs> please spam them up for Enraged Sushi. Thank you so much for supporting the stream and being part of the Dino Pack as but level need three dinosaur. Everyone needs more something Crazy. And they all come to me. Crazy. I'm the boss. Thank CEO you, Snow. Queen. And hello, Snow. How are you Feeling doing? Dramatic. It doesn't That's matter. awesome. Omega has no titled ruler and only one move. Sorry, I wasn't listening to her. What was she saying? Don't fuck with Arya. Okay. I <laughs> have similar rules. Sounds like neither of us likes being jerked around. And on your ship, that would matter. Here, we entertain my preferences. So, what can I do for you? I'm trying to track down Archangel. You and half of Omega. You want him dead too? I'm putting a team together. He's on my list. Interesting. You're gonna make some enemies teaming up with Archangel. That's assuming you can get to him. He's in a bit of trouble right now. What kind of trouble? The local Merc groups have joined forces to take him down. They've got him cornered, but it sounds like they're having trouble finishing him off. They've started hiring anybody with a gun to help. Sounds like that might be our ticket in. They're using a private room for recruiting. Just over there. I'm sure they'll sign you up. Okay. What can you tell me about Archangel? Not as much as I'd like. He showed up here oh, several months ago I guess and started that's causing all sorts Garris? of problems. If you make your own laws, which everyone here does, he makes life difficult. He's reckless and idealistic. But he seems to know enough to stay clear of me. Which Merc groups are after, Archangel? Blue Suns, Eclipse, Blood Pack. They're Omega's major players. Unless they're at war, you'll never see them together. But one thing they hate more than each other is Archangel. Mm -hmm. Do you hate Archangel? I don't have time for hate, but I distrust them all equally. For now, I'm happy just to let them kill each other. I appreciate the help. See if you still feel that way when the mercs realize you're here to help him. So you must know what's what on Omega. Everything that's worth knowing. I don't usually give it out freely. Information is power. Mundane things you can find yourself. Take a walk in a back alley or buy one of the mercs a drink. Better yet, talk to the entertainers. They give great tours. Can you guys hear my stomach? My stomach is making so much noise. Tell me how you got set up here. That's as privileged as information gets. I have many friends and enemies. This I game has so many butt distances. shots that are just there. I don't count you. Just it's butt either. shots. We'll see how useful you prove. Speaking on this game being progressive. Short answer. I'm not so sure. Mind about your own that. damn business. One scan and we're straight to business. <laughs> People are usually more concerned about who I am. Your death was downplayed, but hardly what I call a secret. I had to make sure it was really you. You could have been anyone, anything. Whatever you need will come out on its own. I'm curious, but Omega doesn't really care about you. I'm looking for Morden Solus. Do you know where I can find him? The Solarian Doctor? Last I heard, he was trying to help plague victims Why in the quarantine Why is there a plague? Zone. I always liked Morden. He's as likely to heal you as he is to shoot you. What can you tell me about him? Used to be part of the Solarian Special Tasks group. He's brilliant and dangerous. Just don't get him talking. He never shuts up. If you really need to find him, take a shuttle to the quarantine zone. No guarantee they'll let you in, of course. Thanks for the information. Hey. Yes. Just try not to bring the plague back with you. Sure. Okay, now we know what to do ish. Chug, chug, chug. Okay. More drinks.
Can we skip the animation? No, <laughs> we cannot. We gotta watch this animation. I like that we don't get to choose drink, it's just like one drink. It's the same drink. What if it's uh, something nasty? What do you what drinks do you guys like? What 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 drink do you like? If you order a drink, which one do you order? I don't like beer. Beer is a boring. Oh, can you guys guess? What is my preferred drink? What do you think? Gin and tonic? Mm -hmm. I don't know if I like gin and tonic or not. Nice. Okay, we're done. No more drinks. Go, go, go. Whose day I'm about to ruin. Uh, uh, I'm not looking for trouble. Maybe I am. Oh, she passes out after out more? Here. Really? Find you some. All right, all right. That's I, awesome. I've got stuff to do anyway. Come on, let's get out of here. I don't know what, what we did. Why did I do that? I have no idea. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Come on, let me in. Oh, I wanted to. Okay, so. Oh, oh no! What are the <laughs> this map? Oh no! Um. Oh no. Okay. Um. I. Okay. Oh, uh, <laughs> this is a bit tricky. Um, so where do I go to afterlife VIP area? Merc oh, they were they were in there. Okay. No, we want to buy anything. I I'm gonna guess that we can't afford anything yet, so we'll just skip it. So annoyed. We're gonna go to the merch recruiters and we're gonna find Archangel. Oh, sorry, I'm just gonna tab out really quickly. There we go, sorry about that. I hear you're recruiting. Mm. Oh, the echo? Why don't you step inside? You'll get paid when the job's done, just like everyone else. Who's next? Sweet. You're in the wrong place, honey. Stripper's quarters are that way. Rude! Shoot him! Kill him! Show me yours, tough guy. I bet mine's bigger. Impressive. So, you're here to fight them. You could say that. Standard fee is 500 credits each. You get paid when the job's done. If you die, your friends don't collect your share. You'll need your own weapons and armor. Looks like you got that covered. And no, this does not make you a member of the Blue Sun's Eclipse of the Blood Pack. I want to be part of the Blood Pack. Period. That sounds great. Any questions? Nice. Where do we go? Just head over to the <laughs> transport depot outside the club. One of our boys will take you from there. Sign in the next one. I will get more in first. Oh well. Hey, is this where I sign up? This is it, but it's no game, kid. I grew up on Omega. I know how to use a gun. So does Archangel. I can handle myself. Besides, I just spent 50 credits on this pistol, and I want to use it. We got a prompt for a if Paragon you're sure mission? registration's in here. Good luck. I'll need it. Perfect. Thanks. Oh no, he's an idiot. Uh, head over to the transport depot. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna do the... I think we'll do this mission first. 
I'm not sure what the what the difference will be, but we'll we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Or is it much better to do the Morden mission first? Is it like a huge difference? Is it much, much better? Because if so, I might. Okay, while I wait for you guys to answer, I'll go buy a weapon. Don't you know who I am? Don't you know who I am? Sounds really good. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Then I'll just do it as my gut feeling tells me. Or not gut feeling, just my first my first take. Okay. Harrods Emporium. Imagine this. You're in the Nexus. Tentatively excited. Welcome, human. What can I get for you? What kinds of things do you sell here? Friendly, salvaged parts. All kinds, mostly legitimate. With pride, my prices are the lowest anywhere on the station. You won't Is find having a cigarette cheaper than mine. Oh, I have things to do. Courteously, have a fine day. Take a look at my Bye, sir. If you want the words and full protective coverage for visibility, unencumbered mobility, and increased accuracy. I don't understand what it means. <laughs> oh. Give me that. Yes. Buy it, please. Capacitor. It reduces the delay before your shield. Okay, that's good. Yeah, sure. Thank you, Eldon Whistler. Omni tool upgrade. Okay, sure. Terminus armor. That looks very cool. Increases all shield, here's weapons, sure, it's a okay, what is this? Ooh, I don't know what that is, but I want that one. And now, can I still buy this? I can, but I'll use all of my money. No, it's not. Mm, no, I'll, no, it's not that expensive. Just buy it. Just buy everything. Just buy this too, whatever. Go to the cabin's crew to view personalization items. Oh. Can I change what I'm wearing? No, we cannot. Okay, fine. Fine. Omega Market. Korean Cruiser, buy it. Ornax. Oh. That's a porn. I'm buying it. Um, Blood Dragon. <gasps> Awesome. I mean, yes. <gasps> okay. This looks interesting. I'm just going around buying everything. Dragon Age armor. I love it. Okay, VIP only. Am I VIP? What do you want? I'd like to join the party. This really isn't your kind of place. Afterlife's main floor has lots of drinks and great music. Uh -huh. Can't even shoot him. Got it. Why are the Turians so cute? They're like cute lizards. I love it. Okay. No, you have a key badge, I know. I want to go back to the. I want to go back to the ship, and just put on that Dragon Age armor because it looks awesome. So let me just do that. Super unnecessary. I don't care. I want Dragon Age armor. And you guys can't stop me. That's what we're gonna do. I want to go to the Normandy. Ooh, cool cinematic. But we're not gonna. No, we're not flying away. No, we're not flying away. Uh, okay. Commander, you received a new message at your private terminal. Oh, new message. Deal struck. We reached an agreement with. Did, did I already read it? Oh, okay. 
great. Um, no, What's don't touch me. No. <laughs> I don't like the robot or the AI. It's boring me. <gasps> okay, okay. Here. Armor. Hi. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, look. This one looks so evil too, but yes. Yes, apply. Did I get anything new here? No. Turn off the music. <laughs> no! Ah! There we go. No, okay. Medal of Honors? Nice. Oh! Wait! <laughs> Picture of Liara right there. That doesn't work with our plan to be like, who are you? No. <laughs> oh well. That's fine, I guess. How do I, how do I get off the ship? Do we have to travel there again? I think so. Also, hey Disco and hey SP. How are you guys doing? Have have you guys here? Hope you're having an awesome Saturday. Um. Yeah, we're doing um. Uh, Space Karen Renegade Mass Effect 2 playthrough, which may or may not turn me into a real Karen in real life. Who knows? We'll see. Need to make some coffee. Yeah, I could I could go for a fourth cup of coffee to be honest. Oh, we can bring him now. Oh, oh he's so evil. He's so evil. I'm I'm bringing him and Miranda. You know what? I'm bringing him and Miranda. Jacob is fine, but. This guy, evil. Love it. Mercenary veteran. Wait. Uh, can I... Do I have... Oh. I don't know what the difference. Arc projector. Singularity. Pro Let's get that. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. I'm receiving quarantine warnings about the slums where Dr. This looks Solis stupid. <laughs> I love it. Station. I have also accessed messages between mercenary groups regarding plans to deal with the Archangel. This looks There's so stupid. Perfect. Information on him. Perfect. Hello, take me to Archangel. I'm on the mission. I hope you're ready. Archangel's been annihilating you freelancers. Ready when you are. Look at me, I'm a yeah. freaking dragon knight. Does it look like I'm ready? Or what? We have dragon armor. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. I don't know why I automatically went to like not Jacob, but he feels a bit He he feels a bit bland. A, l a little bit boring. He doesn't have as much of a personality as this Saeed guy. It's about time they sent me someone who looks like they can actually fight. Oh you bet I can fight. You bet. I'm ready to go. <laughs> Is he with you? No, not you. I'm on my own. I don't need any help. Just tell me where to go. Right. Just head through there. I'm sure you'll find your way. Uh, I'm on it. What I don't like is that now you can't see our face because we have the helmet on all the time. They tell you what we're up against? Just tell us where to go. So that's Archangel's a bit boring. Up in a building at the end of the boulevard over there. He's got superior position, and the only way in is over a very exposed bridge. It's a killing ground. But he's getting tired, making mistakes. We'll have him soon enough. I'll get to him. Just point me at that bridge. I like your attitude, but we've got a plan in place. I don't care if your plan. On a distraction team. Head straight over the bridge and keep Archangel busy, so the infiltration team can sneak in behind him. That's goddamn suicide. Pretty much. But you look like Everyone's you teeth suck. Head up to the boulevard and get to the third barricade. Talk to Sergeant Kathka. He'll tell you when to go in. Okay. I better go find Sergeant Kathka. Good idea. Watch yourself on the boulevard. Hey, buddy, how Archangels you doing? killed dozens out there already. Do your teeth suck? Yeah, my shepherd's teeth suck too. They all they look really gonna weird. be easy. Out's gonna be a bitch. Let's worry about finding him first. I just like to see her face because she looks so angry all the time. Shepard, I've scanned the area, but I am unable to plot any other paths to Archangel. That is fine. Because we're going with the Mercs. The heavy mechs and 
gunship possess considerable firepower. Weakening them before leaving will improve your chances. Wait, is it your birthday? That's it's going to be really good. I think it's, it's fun to, to be playing uh, Mass Effect 2. Do you need something? You leave the eclipse? You oh, figure that out by nice. yourself. Happy birthday I'm Jared, in advance. I run That's eclipse. awesome. What do you need, freelancer? I'll get going. Good idea. I'll need to talk to you. Tarek, I've sparking, spoken to Garm and he and his men are on board. Assuming this operation is successful, we can count on high morale and extensive buy-in from the men. From the losses we've already taken, the possibility exists that we won't have the men needed to continue on to the next objective. It's clear though that none of our organizations would be ready to move on Aria without the assistance of the other two. Ew. Deliver the data pad to Aria. Okay. We can do that. Oh! Cool. Smuggling hack? Yes. Okay. Start hack. Oh! 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 I don't know what to do. <laughs> Wait. I thought it was... Find matching code segment. Locate and select the code that matches the code displayed at the top left. Oh! Okay, okay. Okay. White. Okay, okay. Got it. Got it, got it. Uh... Uh... What? Isn't that it? Oh no! I didn't look! It changed! Damn! Okay, wait. I can do it. I'm just... I'm not reading the instructions. I don't see it. Am I crazy? I don't see it. Here. Green, 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 green. I don't see any... What? Here, here. There we go. Nice. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Element zero, bypass friendly foe. Okay, this one I know how to do. Oh no. Oh, lucky. Hacker, <laughs> yes. These mini puzzles are more fun, that actually. Slow them down. Perfect. It'll be hostile if they activate it. Nice. These mini games are more fun than the one in one. Oh, hello. You're in the wrong place, freelancer. I love Krogan. You the blood pack leader? Name's Garm. That's all you need to <gasps> Who's know. Who's that? To I'm left. stuck here waiting till you freelancers are done. Oh, check, war. check, check, check. Ask your questions and go. When did the blood pack attack? Damn terror, Look at that guy. So cool. I hate waiting. But he says the Suns have a plan, and they don't want us getting in their way. Huh. We're supposed to wait until the Eclipse send their max. We'll see. Whoops. Bugged. Give me a second. Okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. These are so cool! These were not in the first game, and they're awesome. I want to talk to one, but I can't. Very short yes. And they sound funny. Great. What's in here? Oh! Protection money accounts. Hack. Okay. I don't like this hack. Uh, what? Why can't I choose? What? What? Oh, sorry. I'm just stupid. Is that it? Um... Am I blind? I'm probably blind. There we go. They're called Vorcha and are, are all raised by the same voice actor as Male Shepherd. That's awesome. That's a cool fact. That's a very cool fact. Okay. Bypass? Oh! Okay, sure. That was easy. A hard on insanity difficulty? I can imagine. I don't even like them. I don't know which difficulty this, this is. This is probably like normal difficulty and I still think it's difficult. 
Okay, money, money, money. All right. Uh... I'm looking for Sergeant Kathka. You and me both, lady. He's over there working on the gunship. We go over the bridge when he gives the word. Go talk to him if you want, but I'm in no hurry. Okay. Why haven't you talked to him? Because I'm not stupid. This assault is damn dangerous. What do you want, freelancer? They don't like freelancers. Excuses? Get this freelancer out of here. I don't have time for this shit. What's your problem? You. <laughs> get, get this scum out of my face. Tarek, what seat in your ass? Zaid. You know this asshole, Zaid? We worked together once. Oh, it was good to Since bring him. Since when do you work for so little? Since when are you a goddamn madman? You're talking to him. This guy's gonna kill me. Almost did already. That bad, huh? Worse. Looks like it. I gotta deal with this shit. Jinta, talk to these guys. Answer whatever questions they have. Good to see you. And who knows? Maybe you'll solve my problem for me. Anything's possible. Good thing you know him. Tarek hates having to hire freelancers. He doesn't trust anyone outside the Blue Suns. You don't say. What can I do for you? We better get going. I don't want idea. anything. Make sure you or check in with Captain. Or Renegade! Nice! Credits. We're doing good. I realize I've only been uh, quick saving, so I just want to do a regular save. She still, her st name is still Jennifer. I know that sucks. We couldn't change name to Karen. I wish we could have. Kafka. Out of the way. So cool armor. <laughs> you look like a knight. Sergeant Kafka. I like the old one better. It's uh, smaller. Uh, you must be the group Salki mentioned. You're just in time. Who? Salki? You met him when you were dropped off. Oh. He radioed to say you were coming. I forgot. You three kind of stand out from most of the other freelancers. Anyway, the infiltration team is about to give us the signal. Archangel won't know what hit him. Got any questions? This may be your last chance. So the bridge is the only way in. Until the gunship's working again or the blaster's finished with the tunnels. Look, we got a plan. We don't need you trying to come up with any great ideas. People Just are smoking a lot in this Collect game. Collect your credits and go home. But, like, everyone is smoking. Are you gonna give us cover with the gunship? Why? Uh, <laughs> Tarek is the only one who flies her. Besides, she's not quite ready. That bastard Archangel gave her a beating last time she was out there. A few more tweaks, she'll be as good as new. Why are you coordinating the attack and fixing gunships? I'm in the infiltration group. Our team coordinates with the gunship. I'm staying back to organize the freelancers and make sure the gunship's ready to go if we need her. Smoking sucks. How will the infiltration team get to Archangel? They've got two options. They trap them in close quarters and finish the bastard off face to face. If that doesn't work, they have explosives. They'll just need time to set up. Are you leading the assault? Ha! <laughs> Tarek doesn't pay me to fight. I just plan the attacks and fix the damn gunship. You freelancers get the privilege of... Target is in sight, where a go? Check. Bravo team! Go, go, go! You'd think they'd be waving, yes. <laughs> quite a surprise waiting for him. But that means no more waiting for me. Gotta get her back to 100% before Tarek decides he needs her again. <gasps> Oh, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. You're working too hard. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Archangel doesn't have much time left. What the hell are we waiting for?
What did she do that? Why not? <laughs> Come on, we'll give these guys a surprise of our own. Cover me up ahead. Just shooting them in the back, you know, casually. That's the plan. Oh, that's giving me a lot of renegade. Nice. I mean, it kind of makes sense that shooting in the back would give you a lot of renegade, but yeah. This looks interesting. <laughs> Does that also give me more renegade? No. This is Garrus, right? I think it's Garrus. Archangel. Dead. So many butt shots. So many butt shots. Shepard. I thought you were dead. What are you doing here? Good to see you too. I'm just surprised to see you. You and me both. Still, it's good to see a friendly face. Killing mercs is hard work. Especially on my own. What are you doing out here on Omega? I got fed up with all the bureaucratic crap on the Citadel. Figured I could do more good on my own. At least it's not hard to find criminals here. All I have to do is point my gun and shoot. How'd you manage to piss off every major Merc organization in the Terminus systems? It wasn't easy. I really had to work at it. I am amazed that they teamed up to fight me. They must really hate me. Since when did you start calling yourself Archangel? It's just a name the locals gave me for all my good deeds. <laughs> I don't mind it, but please, it's uh, <clears throat> just Garrus to you. You nailed me good a couple times, by the way. Concussive rounds only, no harm done. Didn't want the mercs getting suspicious. Uh-huh. If I wanted to do more than take your shields down, I'd have done it. Besides, you were taking your sweet time. I needed to get you moving. Well, we got here, but I don't think getting out is I like it. Easy. He's kind of evil, too. No, it not won't. evil, but... That you know. bridge has saved my life, funneling all those witless idiots into scope. But it works both ways. They'll slaughter us if we try to get out that way. So we just sit here and wait for them to take us out? It's not all that bad. This place has held them off so far. And the three of you, I suggest we hold this location, wait for a crack in their defenses, take our chances. It's not a perfect plan, but it's a plan. I didn't like sneaking anyway. Time to spill a little murk blood. Basically, Batman. True. Let's see what they're up to. I like it. it looks so weird with a mm. nice armor. Looks like they know their infiltration team failed. Take a look. Scouts. Eclipse, I think. Can I shoot them? These are robots. That looks like a lot more than scouts. Indeed. We better get ready. I'll stay up here. I can do a lot of damage from this vantage point. You... Cool. You can do what you do best. Just like old times, Shepard. Let's oh, give I love Garrus. Everything. I love Garrus. What does this do? Oh! Down. <clears throat> oh! Okay. Yeah, that's great. I don't know what that weapon was, but that was great. You could shoot, missed it. Oh, I could. I didn't know I could. Shit. Made it into the base. How do I? Oops. Eclipse marks. Rear stairs. Yes. Oh. 
There's a killing sniper. Okay. That's not a sniper. That's a freaking. Oh no, I'm dying. Wait, how do I how do I medigen? Can I? Shit. Shit. But downside walking for almost two hours listening to space murder and questionable morale. That's sounds good. Walking is good. I am going into town later. I'm thinking if I should walk. Here. There we go. Nice. Okay, let's uh, do that again. And drop. I love it. That was so good. One left. That worked way better than last time. A lot of water. Yeah, it's so warm today. No, don't get in here. Cool. Okay, now there's a lot. But let's do this one again. So handy. I can't do anything about that one. There we go. Nice. Okay, I'm doing so much better this time than last time. It was not so good. I love this rifle. I love this rifle. I don't have any ammo. Shit. Okay, team help me. There we go. Did we do it? Nice. Uh Let's see how you handle this, Archangel. What now? Oh, are these the mix? Didn't we no. hack the mix? Oh, yeah. Damn it. Okay, no. Nope. That problem should take care of itself. Oh yeah, the mix. Yes, yeah. sorry. Don't. Why did I hit the mix? I did hack the mix. Shit. Oops. My bad. I had hacked it, but I shot it anyways. That's stupid. That's good though. So hacking was pretty good because, yep. Yeah. <laughs> I'm running out of ammo again. Make take care of it. Here, nice. No, my 
les mecs. Shooting in this game is pretty hard, actually. There we go. <laughs> Merciless. Hell yeah. Oh, there's more. Kill him. Yay! We good? Looks like that's all of them. Come find me before they regroup. I'm I'm literally right next to you. That was a hard fought victory. At least we took down Jareth. Yes. I've been hunting that little bastard for months. Why were you after him? He's been shipping tainted Ezo all over Citadel space. Half the goods I seized back at CSEC came from his team here on Omega. I took out a big shipment a while back and killed his top lieutenant in the process. Not surprised he decided to work with the other mercs after that. We've still got blood pack and blue suns left. Think we can make a break for it? Maybe. Let's see what they're up to. They've reinforced the other side heavily, but they're not coming over the bridge yet. My face is sweaty. What are they waiting for? <laughs> it's really warm today. What the hell was that? Damn it. They breached the lower level. Well, they had to use their brains eventually. You get is more, shipping. yeah. I'll keep the bridge clear. I didn't come all this way to let you die. We'll split up two and two. Keep one of my team here. You sure? Who knows what you'll find down there? Uh, you can... Uh... Actually, yeah, I'll, they'll stay with me. Good point. I'll keep them with me. All right, you better get going. <laughs> We're on our way. Go down a level. The basement door is on the west side of the main room behind the stairs. I'll Cold radio directions coffee if you need so help, good. but you've got to get down there quick. Good luck. Thank you. Okay, wait, we'll, we'll go to the basement. Okay, I don't know. I'm not sure how. To the basement. How? Oh no. Oh, this way probably. Come on, come on. Oh, come on. Come on. Yes. Oh, this is probably it. Garage, utilize. Those are closed, so this way? I know. I should be ashamed. Wearing something that isn't black, not cool. Ooh! Oh! My shields are down. Watch the Krogan. Oh, that was a lot of bullets. Do I have any grenades? Nope. Make 20 enemies scream as they're set on fire is an achievement I just got. Okay. Cool. Why does it sound like I'm dying? How do I heal? I don't understand how to heal. Don't I have medigel? I don't understand how it works. Oh. Oh, there's so many. Deploying tech overload. Nice. This game looks hype. Hey, Adams. It is really cool. This is Mass Effect 2, Legendary Edition. Oh, don't do that. Ah. Uh... How many of them are there? Take cover? I know, but I... I don't like it. <laughs> Overloading their systems. 
You just have to wait and... Yeah, yeah. You gotta wait for it to recharge. I guess in the previous game you had to heal yourself all the time. But in this one you don't really. How many? Are we really taking out all of them? Like... It's like a million people. So many! Health potions are too hard for... Uh, console gamers? Maybe. Hell yeah! I just keep putting on my shields again a little time. Oh, I don't have any ammo. Ammo, 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 ammo thank you. There's so much ammo over there. Yes, we were doing something wrong. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> okay. Well, XP farming maybe? I don't know. that it's basically a cover shooter at this point. I don't like cover shooters. I want to go in and just... I don't know. Down. Oh, no, no, uh. Punching works so good. Oh, that's a chrome. That's not good. No Rambo mode cooldowns? Maybe. But we're pretty early in the game still, so I don't have that much stuff. Maybe that's why. Oops. Not supposed to shoot Miranda. My shields are down. Oops. Oops. No, I'm dying. Ah, ah. Help. Oh, I have no ammo. Shit. No, don't use that. Shit. Don't let me die. Ah. Ammo. Here we go. Ammo. Ammo, ammo, thank you. Whoops. <laughs> I suck, I know. Wait, are we supposed to- oh my god, I'm an idiot. Seal the door. There we go. I am so sorry. We were supposed to do that again. <laughs> and Garrus is slowly dying. You guys can't see it because I'm in front of the bar, but I think I think we should be fine. We're just wasting a little bit too much time, I think. Oh. 
Which door do I feel? Can I how, how do I go over? How do I this will put them down. There we go. How do I go over? Ugh, okay. There's the door. Come on, Shepard. The controls. The hell. Okay. Oh, what? Wait. Get back here. What is happening? The door. Okay. Bit confused. Uh, rip them to shreds. Watch my back. I'll deal with Archangel. Uh oh. Garm. We're back. To save the day. We've been spotted. I, I mean I I know that. Let's just use the shield. Come in. Gotta help Garrus with a Krogan. Okay, cool. Nice. What now? We done here? Hmm. Tough bastards, <laughs> but I've seen worse. Great. And we took out Garm and his blood pack. This day just gets better and better. Better and There's better. One tough son of a bitch. You fought with him before? Yeah, we tangled once. Caught him alone, none of his gang to help him. We still couldn't take him out. I've never seen a Krogan regen that fast. He's a freak of nature. He just kept at it until his Vorcha showed up. It was close, but I had to let him go. Now he's Not dead. This time. Only the Blue Suns are left. I say we take our chances and fight our way out. I think you're right. tarek has got the toughest group, but nothing we haven't faced before. Besides, he won't be expecting us to meet him head on. Uh oh. Get your head down! Never mind. Damn it! I thought I took that thing out already. Uh, I fixed it, but not completely. I made sure of that. Well, that's not great. Hey, Andrea, Talia, how are you doing? So many mercs. Kill Jenta. I wonder if we could have done this in a more peaceful way. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Are we good?
Uh oh. Don't die. Oh, is he dead? No, he's good. Don't die. Okay, we gotta get stuff in. That's not good. Ah, uh, oh, it's over here now. Oops. What? Okay. Crush them all, I'm trying. Foot locker? Stop. I wish I had a better gun than this. It looks like a machine gun or something. Ooh! That was easier than I thought. Okay. I, I, I don't know why. I expected that to be way more difficult. Oh, blue blood. That makes sense. <laughs> He's not dead. We're getting you out of here, Garrus. Just hold. Radio Joker, make sure they're ready for us. He's not gonna make it. He's gonna make it. Right? I think he's gonna make it. Whoa. Oh, my eyes are so itchy. So much experience gained. Alright. Commander, we've done what we could for Garrus. But he took a bad hit. The doc's corrected with surgical procedures and some cybernetics. Best we can tell, he'll have full functionality, but. But. He looks Shepherd. good. <laughs> Tough son of a bitch. Didn't think he'd be up yet. Nobody would give me a mirror. How bad is it? They did what they could, but you're gonna have some scars. I'm sorry. Some women find facial scars attractive. Mind you, most of those women are Krogan. <laughs> Frankly, I'm more worried about you. I've heard bad things about Cerberus these past few years. The Collectors are wiping out human colonies, Garrus. Nobody else cares enough to stop it. I can't argue with that. Hard to believe the Council is letting the attacks go unanswered, though. Damn politicians. I'm fit for duty whenever you need me, Shepard. I'll settle in and see what I can do with the- Why don't we give him new armor? Why does he have to keep the armor that is, like, completely broken? <laughs> Plus two Renegade. Nice. I feel like we could have gotten a bit more Renegade, but you know what? It's okay. Here, weapons. Oh, I can't choose. I can't choose among these. These are just like I have to have those, but I can choose more here. But then I kind of want to keep that one. Oh well. Okay. I don't want to talk to you, Jacob. I'm busy. Oops. Wrong. No. Nope. I don't want to talk to the robot either. There's like a research station, I think, but I don't know where it is. Map. Oh, the map. Research terminal over here. Okay. Commander, you received a new message at your oh, I can't go in here yet. Is required to use the technical laboratory. Well, message. Command request. Oh, just. I'm too lazy. Upgrades. Okay. Uh, sure. Sure, sure, sure. Should we talk to Joker? I want to talk to Garrus. Hey, Commander, we got Garrus back. That's great, because he was totally my favorite. With that pole up his ass. 
I assume everything's going well up here? I really want a chance to put the Normandy through her paces. I just have to trim up the drive output and it'll be like we never lost her. Safety standards advise against manipulating drive settings while engines are powered and in use, Mr. Moreau. Commander, can we shut this thing off? I don't need it in my day to day. I hate it. Gotta mute. I don't have time to babysit you, Joker. Find a way to deal with it. Yeah, reasoning with the intercom is not my strong point. Your problem, not mine. Thanks, I'll remember this. That's it for now. See you, Commander. I feel like that. I'll remember this being. It's just like, no! Ruining a romance option. Crap. Grab that. Unlocking codex and stuff. Okay, guys, I gotta run to the bathroom quickly. I'm I'm drinking way too much water. I'll be right back. Okay, let's continue. I'm just gonna do this. Nice. Uh, it looks special. Nah, this is just really warm outside. Uh, you, you guys can never tell, but I, I mean, when I'm not wearing sweatpants, I'm usually wearing dress. I'm Yeoman Kelly Chambers. I've been assigned as your administrative assistant. I'll manage your messages and help you monitor the crew. And I must say, 
We haven't said oh, hi to her yet. No, it's like a week into the game and she's like, hello. <laughs> I handle my own business. I understand. I won't bother you unless it's important. Yeah, never Anything bother me. Please never bother me. That'll be all. Yes, Commander. A scientist is required to use the technical laboratory. Um, scientist required. Okay. Let's go down here. I don't know where Garrus is. Is he here? Can I tell? I don't know. Starboard, women's restroom, crew quarters. Um. Yeah, but it's like 25 degrees or something today. So warm. Commander. So nice. What can I do for you? Anything I should know regarding the Normandy? Super the nice. The crew's working well. And the ship appears to be performing to specifications. What exactly are your duties aside from keeping an eye on me? I'm the elusive man's agent. You're his most important asset. My job is to make sure you succeed. Aside from that, I send regular reports to the elusive man, updating our status. Sorry. Too many allergies. I'll let you work. Of course, Commander. Okay, okay. Where is Garrus? Is he not on this flo floor? Oh, can we go back here now? Main battery. Maybe he's here. Because this was closed before. Yes. Hello. Shepard. Need me for something? Have you got a minute? Sure. Just checking the weapon systems. You can never be too careful. I thought I'd seen every weapon. Why did you walk like that? Against Mercenary work showed me otherwise. And now Cerberus rebuilds the Normandy with a few upgrades to boot. I wish we'd joined up with them sooner. I'm pleased to see that you're getting along with the new crew. They're as friendly to me as people from a group like Cerberus can be. And they've got you vouching for them. I can't exactly doubt your judgment. Not after I got my own squad killed. How did those mercenary gangs take down your team? It was my own damn fault. One of my people betrayed me. A Turian named Sidomis. He drew me away just before the mercs attacked my squad. Then he disappeared. Everyone except me is dead because of him. Hey there, Because Seal. I didn't What's see up? it coming. You sure it was a betrayal? Maybe they took Sidonis out first. No. I put out feelers with some old contacts. He booked transport off Omega just before the attack. He also cleared out his private accounts before he left. He sold me out and ran. Do you know where Sidonis is now? No. His trail vanishes after he leaves Omega, but I'll keep hunting. I lost my whole team except for Sidonis. One day I'll find him and correct that. Nice. Thanks for coming by, Shepard. I've got some things to take care of. Oh, can't even flirt. Damn it. Oh, but we got Renegade. Nice. I don't even know what we got Renegade. I didn't even do anything. Okay. <laughs> or I feel like I didn't even do anything. I didn't do anything bad. Um. Hey, Big Dicker. <laughs> Welcome back. How are you doing? Uh, where's the- oh, here's the elevator. Let's go. We haven't been in engineering so much. You came all the way down here to see us? Sure. You're speaking to our commanding officer. I didn't hear an officer on deck. I run this ship military. You two think this is all a joke? <laughs> yes, ma'am. I mean, no, ma'am. Won't happen again, ma'am. Better not. At ease. Who are you? I'm Engineer Ken Donnelly, handling the power control systems. This is Gabby. That's Engineer Gabriella Daniels, actually. I'm responsible for the propulsion systems. What can we do for you, Commander? I'm good. Uh, there's so many dialogue Carry options. On. You know Will what? Do, Commander. My my shepherd just doesn't care that much. I think this is my story because there, there's so much call, um, dialogue, and sometimes it's nice, but it's also sometimes maybe a bit too much. So I'm skipping some of it. 
Wow, the ship is huge. There's this whole area down here. I'm just guessing some of the people we're gonna pick up are gonna be down here. There's gonna be people everywhere once we pick more people up. How'd I go to the elevator again? Shit. Um, here. Nice. Uh, let's check the cabin as well. Oh, I kind of like to check, check the ship. What's this area of the ship? This is the commanding officer's quarters. That's me. It's larger than the quarters of other warships I've served on. This is a Cerberus vessel, not an Alliance warship. Accommodations have been made for personal taste. That said, this space is directly under the exterior pressure hall. The fitting yard workers called it the loft. Oh, I like this one, but I like this better because you can see her face, so we'll keep that, I guess. But yeah, I'm good. I'm a little bit tired. I don't know. My eyes are getting tired today. I don't know if it's... I don't know. Probably just because it allergies and stuff. So, now I guess there was another quest here. So I, I guess that's what we gotta do. The other one with the, the plague thing. Was that here? I guess it was here. Oh, and also we can bring a thing to uh, Arya. What's her name? Arya? Yeah. Let's do that. Fly back to the place. Whoops. Uh, yeah, we're obviously bringing Garrus. Should we bring... Who do we bring? Garrus and Miranda? Or Garrus... Oh, I don't know why I don't like him. <laughs> it's, he's fine. But I kind of like Saeed. He got allergies, yeah. Hey, Eclipse Libra. Wait. Add. Let's bring Saeed. I like him. Uh, oh, two points. What does Overload do? Defender? Oh, yes. I can't choose these yet. Okay, cool. Garrus. Oh, he has a lot. Just, uh... Grab that. Great. Said. uh... Yeah. Cool. I'm just pressing everything. How's it going? I just beat the third game last night. Oh, that's awesome. That's really cool. I, uh, uh, yeah, we're on the second one. Warnings about the slums where Dr. Morton Solis runs the clinic. Anticipate resistance at the transport station. The slums, I have also right. run searches for reports on Archangel. The various mercenary groups appear to believe that he is dead. Works What's better than I remembered? It is really good. I really enjoy it. It's, uh, it's very cool. Let's bring the thing to her. Oh, we can talk to him. Arya has a job she needs doing. You up for some work? Not right now, no. The offer stands. Okay, tell me what it is. Arya has a job she needs doing. <laughs> I thought this would work? be a renegade option. It depends on what Arya has in mind. Arya's gotten word that some blood packed mercs plan to kill an old acquaintance of hers, a Krogan named Patriarch. She'd like you to keep that from happening. What's the blood pack's problem with Patriarch? If you've met Patriarch, you know. He can't keep his damn mouth shut. Some people don't appreciate his stories, especially when he dips into non-fiction. Mm, I don't know how big of a difference it is, but that could be a good idea. If you if you if you like the most of you another interest in protecting him. Uh, Pat Patriarch was one of her deadliest enemies back in the old days. Now she keeps what's left of him around as a trophy. As long as he lives, he's a perfect example of what happens when you go up against Arya. Why come to me? Arya's usual muscle not up for the job? Because Arya said so. What other reason do you need? If Arya wants my help, she better tell me why. I'm not doing this for my help. Fine. Whatever gets you to take the job. If it gets out that Arya's protecting Patriarch, well, that can look like a weakness. And some people might want to exploit that. You're not on her payroll, so you helping Patriarch just seems like a random act of kindness. I'll look into it. Good. Patriarch's downstairs, likely surrounded by his fans. Get him into hiding until the mercs move on. 
Come back here when it's done. You'll get your due. I'll be back when the job's done. Cool. Good luck. Uh, I played the first one and a bit of the second one. I, I can't remember if I finished the second one before, but it was a really long time ago, so I don't remember anything. So, no spoilers. But it, yeah, it was super long ago. What do you need? This data pad was on one of the mercs going after Archangel. They were coming for you next. Let me see. Interesting. Would someone like to tell me how this information slipped the net? I'll, I'll look into it. Thanks for the heads up, Shepard. Looks like I'll have to do a little cleaning in my organization. No problems. I'm looking for Morden Solus. Do you know where I can find him? The Solarian Doc? Oh. I always liked Morden. We if already asked really this. Thanks for the information. Yes. Already asked that. Okay, so now we just gotta go to Morden. Got it. Okay. But yeah, I, I, I can't remember how long I got into the second game. I think maybe I didn't finish it, but I'm not sure. I don't remember anything, to be honest. Come on, let me in. I remember there's like a prison we're going to later, and that's about it. But, okay, so slums are over here, we're gonna go to Morden. I'm gonna end the stream here, guys. It's gonna be the end. Because I am really tired. My eyes are just so tired. I think I need to go stare at nothing Protesters for a while. Um, but yeah, I, I was thinking this would be a much shorter stream, but it's actually not because it's been three and a half hours pretty much. So that's 